Remember that Seuss's Mansion song? <gasps> now we blanching, now we blanching. I live, live up, up in, in a, a mansion. mansion. Now we. <laughs> okay, so Lance's umbrella broke completely. So he's using his personal whiteboard. <laughs> it's dirty, so we're cleaning it right now. <laughs> Oh, oh my fucking god. I'm so fucking you know, I'm smart. <laughs> my friend Julia awesome. is recording it. Oh, okay, I was wondering. So, remember that snap that I made where I said, uh, I'll, I'll fucking <laughs> myself and it's a photo of my umbrella? Yeah, I do remember That's that. That's the day. And I have. Oh. All right, and, and I, I'm holding a whiteboard. I'm gonna meet it for now. But I'm holding a whiteboard over my head because it's raining like. And I brought a whiteboard so we could do some stuff for the TV show. And I'm like, well, it's dirty. And I got. I need an umbrella. All your plans for Fatal Arrow just went down the drain. We took the photo. Literally. Of course. Oh, I hate this guy. <laughs> I shouldn't be revealing that. People can know about Fatal Arrow. Oh, they, do they? Oh, they can know. It's they can know. Not enough me. <laughs> not enough me. Welcome to podcast. 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 I love podcasts. podcast. What podcast? Whose podcast I is forgot. this? Oh my god. The Bobblers. <laughs> Welcome back to the EP episode. It is an EP app. EP app. You look okay. very comfy. I've I got the most sleep here. You okay? No, look, 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 look at look at his hoodie. I'm literally I could fall asleep right no, now. No, it's he's, he's definitely got I'm the drip. I'm so EP. I'm so cozy. Like Whenever I be I'm a snoozer, man. I just be snoozing. I'm like an eeper. If you don't hear Adam <laughs> talking, he might be falling asleep. Like yeah. I'll I'll be honest, but um. Okay, I'm EP, but like I'm more energized for some reason. Because you're you're on the best podcast. The best podcast I'm here, on. The world on the platform. That you're well, you know what happens to the person who falls asleep first at the sleepover? <laughs> they don't wake up with cum. Depends on if you're honk shu or honk me me me. Shit! Oh, I didn't even think about that. <laughs> Fuck! That's true. Well, who gets it worse, the honk shu or the honk me me me? Okay, let's follow up. Are you a honk shu or a honk me 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 kind of guy? Uh, we're gonna alienate our audience today. Yeah, I feel like <laughs> Let's do I feel it. like I'd give a couple honk shoes. You're a honk shoe. I feel like honk me 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 is like uh, the feather on top of the mouth is gonna float up and back down more. Yeah. More so than if you're a honk shoe. If you're a honk shoe, you're just gonna <laughs> everybody in beds around you is gonna like elevate, raise up, and then fall <laughs> back down <laughs> without waking up. No, um, I I have an opinion of myself. If you guys want to guess which which one I am. Oh fuck! Do you guys want to put a marble on it? Yeah, let's do a marble. You want to put a marble on this let's right fucking now? Let's do it first. Now? Marble. Let's go. Oh my god! All right, it's against you. It's it's it's. it's so what, what was your guess? I was me 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 me. I swear I, I can't do it. What the fuck am I doing? <sighs> Shoo. Shoo. You no. did it right. You okay. Did it. You I, did it I swear I didn't change my answer for the sake of the marble, but I am a honk me 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 me, me kind of guy. Hey, put her there. Well, first marble! Uh, first marble! First marble. marble! Okay, if you don't understand what a marble is, because we haven't fucking explained it at all. Um, marbles <laughs> is a game on Steam. Where is Steam? There it is. Uh, it's a game on Steam uh, called Marble with Friends, or Marble on Stream or something. And you can... Uh, it, it's like a physics-based game where marbles race to the end of things, but you can put like different names for these marbles, and we put a few punishments on uh, some marbles. Um... Sam will be enacting the punishment if applicable. Uh, I have to update it. Oh yeah, we are we are enacting that bad boy. <laughs> um, I don't I don't think I added raw egg, so you're safe from raw egg. <laughs> raw um, eggs? I would hope so. No, I would drink a shot of fucking raw eggs. Would give you? A shit. That's that sounds raw nasty. Eggs. It probably is. It's because like <laughs> there was an era on YouTube where like drinking raw eggs was was the thing. Oh really? It's like shit. Oh, it, like that was like the punishment in my salmonella era. Honestly. You said salmon was your favorite food, so you're welcome. <laughs> salmonella. It's same thing. Round up. Same thing. That sounds like something you would name your daughter. <laughs> what? Salmonella. What? That's a mad Sam name. Sam and Ella. Are you saying you want to sleep with my daughter? Whoa. My daughter Ella. That whoa, whoa, is whoa, whoa. not what I was implying. I think you're. That's what you're saying. In the slightest. Sam, Sam did that, what to Adam's daughter? Sam got that countdown. That's clock. good. Uh, that's good. Um, clickbait for for this app. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> okay, of the very few people that fucking know us, they're like, hold on, Adam has a daughter, and Sam slept with her. <laughs> that's actually that's crazy. Trying to. 
Okay, they're that do, I think no, that doesn't make it worse. I guess I guess that makes it like marginally better. It makes but. it slightly. But he can be redeemed, but he probably won't be. Yeah. All right, marble, marbles, marbies. Marble. Marble. I love marbles. You, but you won't gonna... after this. I have to move to the other monitor. Hold on. Oh shit! I just realized okay, we didn't clap. Fuck. All right. We're, we're, okay, we right, did right, not let's clap. Let's clap it right now for the audience. Cover we're your ears. Right. Clap. We forgot to sync our mics. Whoops. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna hate myself in editing. Yeah, you're. Oh, fuck. You I thought I got everything like down. I was speed running the setup. Anyways. If you notice, Sam kind of ruined the emo vibe for today. Right, bro. We were all EP and emo. I was actually gonna wear like a dark maroon shirt, but then I switched it for this green shirt. I didn't I realize it was it, the. Though. I don't know why. Oh, I think. How do you feel you. being so happy and joyous? Um, really depressed. Why are you not sad? Why yeah, really, you be. really depressed. You feel bad. For Your vibes are too so silly. Happy. Yeah. What can I say? We got two silly vibes for the sleepy ebb. Okay, silly vibes. Silly Go. vibes. How the fuck do I? Maybe we need to bring Go. Fast Clown back. There it is. <laughs> All right. Like that, oh man, the spooky. Picture. Hold on. So let's see what we got here. How do, do, I, how do you? Say oh that? what? Uh, I, I thought it was just. I've like never the seen this race. game. Oh wait, maybe I have. It is a marble game. Wait, can I? What are here? Hold on. Isn't it start up there in the? Yeah, but the marble should be there already. Hold on. Dude, twelve-year-olds know so many okay, homophobic slurs. Pussy ass fart. No, like. The other day, remember I told you there was the kid who was talking about the level three gats at the tennis, dude. Honestly, How do children know about this? All right, let's be honest here. Honestly, I'm scared of oh, what like kids. I the game. Like, how much do kids actually know? How connected are they? You know, <laughs> to the... kids today. <laughs> yeah. Like, when I was ten, I had like a fucking um, iPod Touch. Yeah. And I didn't really go on the internet. I just played Doodle Jump. You ever have the original iPod? It was just like the music shuffler thing. Yeah. Dude, I think I still have that. I made some somewhere. songs on there. I actually recorded my first song. It was called Cool Cave. Based after a level in Kirby. Are I you still serious? It went. It went like, Dude. Cool Cave. Cool Cave. Cool Cave. Cool Cave. <laughs> cool Cave. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you've to never God. told me that. Have I never told you? No. I guess we've never talked about iPods. No. Wait, I that's crazy. Do you... Is your iPod just gone now? Yeah, it was blue and black. I remember it. Mine was blue and white. Blue and white. Yeah. I think yeah. I even got my name. Like, you know how you can get your name kind of like engraved on it? Yeah. I think I had mine. And I used... I remember listening to motherfucking like Lady Gaga and shit. <laughs> That was like <laughs> Lady Lady Gaga was so fire when we were like thirteen. She still is. But oh my like, god! There was just something about Lady Gaga when you were like twelve or thirteen. That dun, was like, dun, 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 yeah, like bad ma, 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 ma. All right, early twenty tens like, pop. Bad romance over like the montage video, like YouTube montage videos. You remember like Black Eyed Peas, like in twenty tens with all their like EDM shit. God, it's such a vibe. Oh my the time. god. It it has not aged well at all though. I couldn't like sing one Black Eyed Peas song. I, oh wait, dude. boom boom boom. Gotta get, gotta get boom, that boom boom boom. boom. Gotta, get. gotta get that boom Bro, boom it's boom. Crashed twice. Get that boom boom. Just like get Sam and his boom boom. Gotta get that uh, boom, boom boom. Mini Cooper. Yeah, I got that. But you got it. Pretty sure I got it. What? Oh shit! Hell, pizza. Ready, foosball. You Hell, want me to throw pizza! Yeah, at you? yeah. Do not throw Freddy Foosball at me. Oh, <laughs> no. we're going, we're going. Sorry, Freddy Foosball is on Sam's face right now. Marble's going. Marble's going. Throw him. Oh shoot! Uh, All right, we're going. It's going down a funnel right now. Also, I think I think the keyboard's broken. Oh, we're so watching oh, Hell Pizza. pizza. I kind of want to do Hell Pizza. Okay, donate to, to charity's winning though right now. I can't see the names. There's donate so to charity. Many. One to a hundred is winning. Wait, no, 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 I don't want to donate to charity. Fuck charity. <laughs> also, I, 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 Hell, I, I, pizza, I, I come can't on. switch my key. I can't switch the people because my keyboard died, I think. Fuck. Name five Black Eyed Peas songs or get shot. <laughs> 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 We're sliding down. Donate to charity is fucking, is, is gaming right now. Hell, right, pizza I'm, is actually doing I'm really well. I'm going to switch to the keyboard. The, I kind of want to try that yeah. one, to be honest. I know I'm not going to want it in the moment. <laughs> name five Black Eyed Peas songs or get shot. <laughs> I don't know if I could name two. I'm going to be honest. No, I couldn't. All right, back. That's such a product of its Donate time. to Charities. In, is, uh, look at how ahead Donate to Charity is. Oh, my fucking God. I don't even want that one. Dude, I want Hell Pizza. 
It's your fault for not specifying how much I had to donate. It says one to a hundred. It's you know, it's a random number generator. Oh no! Wait, it could die. It could fall off. Charity could fall it off. It can actually it do better. that. Yeah. There charity are two hell pizza. pizza. Dude, both of the hell pizzas are literally in second, third place respectively. Donate to charity is so close, but if it dies, hell pizza is definitely winning. Random order though, it came back. <gasps> oh fuck! Nope. Donate to charity, still there. No. Whichever one I have to no. spend less money on. Thinking random order the died. Person. There's one more random order. By the way, the next donate to charity ma, ma, is literally ma, ma. in 10th place. Come on. <laughs> Fuck you, charity. Kid named charity. Kid named charity. Oh my god, he's fucking... Look at how far away second place is. I can't see. Your big ass booty in the way. <laughs> yeah, you like it. <laughs> <You're> <laughs> I'm not saying I don't. I'm just saying I can't see the Your big the ass progress. booties in the way. Oh! Oh! oh, oh it fell off! It died! died. Yo! Yeah, help help pizza! Help pizza's first. But next up Come is on, random... Gets, gets lapped, died too. Shot of hot sauce? Oh, no. oh Shot of hot sauce is coming! <laughs> oh, shit! Wait, wait, wait. Let's rethink this here. Get slapped! Wait, get slapped! It's still first! Let's rethink and it's priorities. gone! Wait, this is crazy. They're all dying. What? Dude. Random order. Hell pizza! I'm so no, scared. No, risky skip. It's dead! I don't know what the other ones are. Random yeah. order. Shot. Okay, random order next time we eat out. Hell pizza. There's only four <laughs> left. NPC stream died. Random order, help you. No, too. not the NPC stream. Oh, no, NPC stream, that's designed. No, I, oh, no, I wanted you to go ice cream no, so good. No. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. The NPC yes. stream's the one I'm actually scared of. Oh, no, random order wins. There it is. Ah, that's kind of lame. Oh, that's I mean, kind of lame. That's not that bad, to be honest. Like, I was hoping for I was hoping for NPC stream or help you to. I know you were. Yes, yes, yes. Random order. So I just like... Close my eyes and pick a random thing from the menu. Yeah, you just gotta like. Shit. No, it's better. So I mean, basically, it's next better. Time, next time we go out, you have to like order something random. But then you know how you can like change shit on the, your item. You also have to random, randomly choose that. Oh. oh. So you know. Beef coleslaw. Beef. Beef. Coleslaw. coleslaw. <laughs> can I get the beef coleslaw? Can I? You want you want beef coleslaw, <laughs> beef. You want the this beef coleslaw, bro. What? I don't, I don't think <laughs> this keyboard works. This is unlistenable. Fuck. Hey, let me get a pizza with extra cheese. Extra cheese. And hold the tomato sauce. Hold the tomato sauce. And hold the crust. Hold the crust. Hey, hey Jimmy, give me a pizza. Give me a cheese with nothing. Nothing. <laughs> yeah, nothing. I don't know. Is this a reference? Am I am I out of it? I'm pretty am sure I, we're out of it. Am I yeah, not done? Dude, we haven't even you're gotten out. to the first Include? topic yet. The first topic is this. We're talking about this for the whole app. I'm pretty sure this keyboard's dead. Fuck. All right, whatever. I'll is it battery out. powered, or do you have to charge battery. it? Battery. L. I could probably find one, but I don't feel like it. Um. Anyways, we have very exciting news in the world of Labo Cats. My little oh. man. Very big news indeed. Labo pillow. Um. Labo I pillow. Know. I don't I'm, know I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna pull up a DM. Uh, fuck, where's her name? Okay. Guys, so, hold on, wait, don't, wait, don't, don't look, don't react yet. Stop looking, stop looking. Okay, I'm not, so, I'm not looking. As you guys know, Labo is infamously sexist. He hates women, okay? Oh, yeah. So based. Yeah. Um, extremely based. Extremely based. But, we're gonna reveal the image now. Look, that is a woman, and he's sitting in her lap. What? Insane Never before seen. Never before seen if photos. If this gets out. X is going to have a field day with this. True. X is going to be like, he doesn't hate women anymore? What the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> this is not <laughs> Labo-esque. This is not uh, appealing to Labo support base. <laughs> <laughs> but no, my, 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 my buddy Michaela came over for the weekend, and we hung out, and Labo was being surprisingly quiet and calm and kind. And we so like we went like, 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 like on your lap to like signal him to get up, and he, get, he, he got up and he sat there for like 20 minutes. Who are you and what have you done with Labo? Shit. Oh my god, yeah, is this like an imposter? Is like the shapeshifter guy? The from... shapeshifter from Among Us. Yeah, from Among Us. That's where I was going this with is, that. This is crazy. But no, he's a, he's a good little boy. He bit her, now to be fair, he bit her like 30 minutes later. Okay, well, I mean, that's, <laughs> she's a, she is a woman at the end of the day. Yeah. Oh my god! <laughs> wow! Alright, TikTok, 
take that, clip it, make it its, its own sound. Can can people put that over songs? Be like, boo, boo, boo. She is a woman at the end of the day. <laughs> <laughs> the <laughs> bass <laughs> drop. Yo, yo that'd, that'd be, be fire. fire. <laughs> you don't even have to make that a story. Somebody else will make it. Someone that else is going to do it, yeah. Oh, yeah, for sure. Um, But, yeah, you guys don't understand. He's Labo has literally bitten every single woman that's entered my house within the hour. That's not a joke. Yeah, every single woman that's ever entered this house within the hour has been bitten. Not a big really? fan. So this this, this was a ma- major major um, discovery. Yeah, based based Labo. Maybe next time he won't. If, if he doesn't bite the next woman that enters his house, that would be like that'd be bananas. That'd be serious character development. Yeah, serious character development. It would be, but is Labo even Labo at that point? That's how, yeah. Hating women's kind of part of his identity. In it way, is. You know. I mean. <laughs> Isn't it part of all of our identities? Like, you, you say Labo no to comment. somebody. <laughs> no comment. Labo from Squabblers. Oh, that's the cat that hates women. Right? That's that, That's the first thing you think of. It's not like, oh, that's, that's the true. cat that loves and respects, like, respects women respects and like, people, people like, for who they are, you know? Yeah. He's listening to, like, All Girls on the Same on repeat for, like, <laughs> 10 years now. It's yeah. like, <laughs> oh, my God. All girls are the, the same. same. <laughs> that's all I know. That's it. <laughs> That's the whole song. Is that That's song even song. ten years old? Is it ten I don't years think old? So, dude. That song's like five years old. Yeah, it's not that old. Time yeah. sucks. Like, um, time does suck. I, 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 we got to the topic of time in a criminology class, and not like oh, time sensitive. Like talking about like philosophy and stuff. It was really fucking funny. It's like our years go faster because you know, like the amount of time that we spend, like like this year is only one nineteenth of our lives. And that's why it feels so much faster. And next year is going to feel even faster because it's one twentieth of our lives. Have you ever heard Yo. that? No. It's it's kind of sick. Oh my god. It's kind of sick. That's actually kind of insane. Yeah. I never wow. even thought about it like that. Um. That's, what else? I don't like that. There was okay. We we should bring this up now so we don't have to do it later. Uh. We got we have we have a little little YouTube drama if you want to put it. Oh that yeah, way. we could talk about that now because we <sighs> want to get to the fun stuff later. Yeah. This is not. We're gonna fun. we're gonna we're gonna start with something a little less fun. We've been trying to like stay stay clear of like things that are not at like like you know we want to relax here. We want people to be able to listen to this while they're doing their laundry and not be like oh my god I want to put a bullet in my head with a gun. Um, <laughs> and with the gun is that what, is this gun. topic gonna make people commit suicide? Is that what we're probably driving not. out here probably not this is like, that'd this, be kind of insane if it did but I, okay so basically if you guys haven't kept up uh Cyper wolf is this youtuber content creator um SS Sniper and i'm gonna Ooh, just yeah. do it i'm just gonna fucking do it um is this sniper wolf yeah it's a sniper wolf you know you know who she is right sniper wolf the the girly yeah she does reaction content with the uh with, with the what with the Level three. Oh my god! Level three. I mean, he's not wrong. <laughs> Shut the fuck he's not up! Not wrong. No, 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 That's no. all I know. I don't of know. All, of all of all people to like simp over, she's yeah. not one. She's been all in right. a lot of hot water recently. She's been in hot water. I'll explain. Like, uh, so she, why the water's so she, boiling? She did like in the old days, like you know, like the woman pranking, see, like COD shit, like gamer girl stuff. Whatever. I didn't care for it. I it didn't really matter. And then Jax Films, who's like a veteran YouTuber. Um, he he started talk speaking out about her because like she does a lot of reaction content and reaction content fucking sucks. Mm-hmm. All right, that's why like when we watch videos, I try not to include the whole thing. You know, I I try to like uh, like like think last episode I really tried to like stop early and watch stuff. You know, because I don't want to just have a sit here silent and be like <laughs> for thirty minutes while a video plays. Like that's that's dog shit content, and and, and it's like theft honestly yeah. in my opinion. So, and Cyberwolf has been doing that for like pff, forever mm. on YouTube. And Jack Holmes called her out on it. He made this. He made a whole channel parodying her, where he would watch her videos. Be like, ha, 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 ha. <laughs> that is so based. Uh, it's so funny. And he had some other. He had some other videos like uh, actually critiquing her. It's cool, cool stuff. Um, and it's been going on for a few months. And honestly, it's it went on for so long because like I didn't really care to keep up. Like, okay, Cyberwolf sucks. Let's move on. Yeah. But this. Recently, Sniper Wolf posted something on her Insta story. Should I go to Jack's film's house? His house is five minutes away from my shoot or something. Yeah. So she goes to his house and posts a photo of her outside of his house, uncensored. Hey, come out. Let's fucking talk. Uncensored. Like, 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 like people, showing the address. Whatever. Yeah. Okay. Full on docs. Yeah. Full on just docs. <laughs> And it it was it was insane. Like 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 she just 
Stripe will straight up just dock stretch them. So that was not That's on crazy. my bingo card this year. No, <laughs> like, no. It was. It's it's so annoying. And the most annoying part is like YouTube, straight up has said, worse than nothing. Actually, worse than nothing. What have they said? So, I haven't seen the so response. For, first off, they said nothing. You know, people are just like, it's been five days, I think, since this happened, and YouTube still said jack shit. Um, people are like, please get her off this fucking you know website. She's dog shit. She's had horrible content. YouTube said nothing, and then YouTube fucking tweeted out. I think it was yesterday. Would it be too meta to do a reaction video to a reaction video? Oh, they actually said that. For that's fuck's real. Sake, that's real. That's a real thing. Oh, ouch. Yeah, that's YouTube? that's really bad. Why YouTube you do that? And, and, and and Twitter. That's so bad. Don't do that. And, and the community notes literally <laughs> added for additional context. It needs to be known that this tweet was written in the wake of a controversy regarding reaction YouTuber Sniper Wolf, who recently leaked the personal information of a fellow creator on the platform, Jax Films. They have not responded to fucking anything. So what people yeah. have done now is they'll go, hey, at YouTube, someone made fun of me. Can I dox their, their address? And then they didn't even say no. They didn't even fucking say no. They're just like, well, unfortunately, due to policy, if you do stuff bad stuff outside of the platform, you can't get banned in this platform. I'm like, shut the fuck up. Just ban them. Dingus. Just yeah. fucking ban them, dude. Like, it's so easy. And I know why they're not. Sniper Wolf makes like a billion dollars from them every day. It's very yeah. popular. Uh, and, and, and like, uh, I feel like a lot of guys are going to try to be like, yeah, she's a fucking woman. Like, like, no, that's cringe. Let's just be real. It's all about money. YouTube YouTube doesn't give a shit about if you're a woman or a man or black or white or whatever. I mean, I, I mean, okay, maybe there's like individual circumstances of that, whatever. This is not about that. This is about making as much fucking bread as possible. And mm-hmm. Cyber Wolf is bringing them bread because of all the slop that she fucking makes. And it's, it's yeah, so for sure. annoying. It's like, it, it just set, it sets a bad precedent. Just straight up. Yeah. Like okay, maybe let let's say something just doesn't let, let's say something doesn't happen to Jack Storm somehow, right? In the future, people are gonna be like, oh, she can do it. I'm gonna fucking I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna dox gonna people as and as no, as get no repercussions for exactly. it. Yeah. And it's 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 so bad. It's such a bad look. Like even I, I would have even preferred if they did like a vague thing, being like doxing is never okay in our community. Blah blah blah. If it's found, we'll take corrective steps, and then that gives us hope that in the future something's gonna be said, something's gonna be done. You know, it's several was being a fucking. How do I put this? I don't care. Several was being a fucking bitch about it because she's put on her Instagram story like we show up to her house. What are you doing? It's her and her, her sister. I'm like your son. Your son. You got away with a actual federal fucking crime in yeah. California. Can you not? And then her sister on Twitter responded to someone being like, "You shouldn't come up like do that." Responding, what, does he not know how to fight or something? You are literally admitting that you went to his house to fucking fight him. You are actually one of the dumbest fucking human beings in the United States of America, which is saying something. Yeah, that was deranged. That's absolutely deranged. Yeah. You know, she has a video from like eight years ago called I Am a Stalker. Yeah, I saw that. A lot of shit's coming out about her. Power trip. Yeah. Wasn't it like the main drama was about her and her boyfriend? How her boyfriend would like record um gameplay of like call of duty and other shooter games and mm-hmm. she'd just be like the face of the operation and then they split up oh, I remember that, and yeah. he wanted half the money to the business or something like that it was insane wait a minute she would like play like act like she was playing act like she was playing but the whole time it was her boyfriend honestly oh concerning this drama it's like whatever cares yeah, yeah compared yeah. to this compared to what That's happened true. very recently that whole shit, like, it doesn't matter. Yeah. I, I think, um, I was going to say, there, there's this, a lot of shit's coming out from things that were bad in the past, too. Like, there's this one Omegle video she did where she gets in a call. Oh, I saw this. She gets in a call yeah. with, like, two young boys. Like, they're, like, fucking Oh, 10, I did see this. Or 11. Yeah. And they're, like, she's like, hey, shake your ass. I'll show you my tits. She said that to an 11-year-old. <laughs> oh, my God. Ugh. And then their mom catches them. It's just fucking oh gross, gross. Yeah, she's not content. a good person. I think that's very clear now. Yeah, I, I like for, for for the record, her shit's been shit for a very long time. Like she has not made good content in when did she join the platform? Ten years ago. She hasn't made good content for ten years. Straight up. Right. Like, I I I try to be very flexible with YouTubers. I try out. You know, like I like to watch smaller channels, so like give give them a shot. You know, I like to experiment with different genres. Yeah, I've tried Cyberwolf. She's just not, she's not for me, and she's not 
healthy for the fucking YouTube environment. Because, like, I... I it's, oh, it's so annoying. I thought, like, I thought Reaction Content was dead and buried. She's still here. You know? Oh, my God. I remember when that was, like, super popular. That was a reaction, reaction videos was like the shit. I get mad, like I get recommended reaction videos from like smaller channels. I'm like, stop, be yourself, dude. Honestly, the only reaction content that I enjoy is like, uh, there's some interesting like music reaction content, that, from like, like in depth um, discussion about. I don't, yeah, I, I don't even, I honestly don't even regard that as reaction content. Right. Yeah. It's, like completely, a, it's different. It's, it's more like it's analysis. analysis. It's, it's more. Yeah. Analysis. I think yeah. there, there's there's an important distinction, distinction. like the uh, legal eagle. Um, he's a lawyer YouTuber. I love which is Legal Eagle. Insane. I've way. actually that probably name dropped him on this show before. Really? <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, he's great. But I you haven't him. heard it. Uh, Legal Eagle. Uh, he he'll react like periodically. He'll react to like a TV show. He'll react to movie scenes. You know, YouTube videos, and he'll be like, "This is illegal," or, yeah. or you know, if it's a cartoon, like this would be illegal if this happened. You know, um, like some of his famous ones. There's like Better Call Saul scenes. Um, some SpongeBob stuff. It's really sick, and it's yeah. it's fun. it's fair use. First off, he's a lawyer. He would know what fair use is. Mm -hmm. And second, he's just not a dickhead. <laughs> I don't know. It's pretty simple. It's pretty yeah, easy. it's not just like simple. Like, oh my god, I can't believe that. Like, he's actually providing he's, analysis. He's it's so very in, informative in, go, in a fun goes, way. He goes it's, so in depth because he's so knowledgeable. Right. But, like, I, th I think for the SpongeBob video, he was just like, um, like he brought up like he, he brings up real laws. He brings up real examples in history. Yeah, like, he knows his shit. I couldn't give a shit about it outside of uh, his videos, but his videos are so engaging. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. He, his voice is so modern. Yeah, I love him. I love him. <laughs> Big shout out. But yeah, that's a little YouTube drama. We can drop it there. I think there's not much to say. Fuck, fuck you, Sniper Wolf. Moral of the story: L Sniper Wolf. Ooh. Sniper Wolf. Ooh. Um, anyways, Squabbler's better. That's that. That's not saying much. I'm just saying. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, because we don't sit there going. Hard. What the freak, guys? Whoa. What the flip? You know what? that single moment just earned us like a hundred subscribers. <laughs> <laughs> That's the the retent the most replayed on the on the browser is just <laughs> they just watch that entire thing. Um. Anyways, um. Okay, this drama is technically more drama, but I just find it really funny because I think fraud is really funny. SBF Sam Bank, free. Fuck, fuck what is his name? Ba Sam, Sam Bankman Freed. Do you not know about this? No. <gasps> Do you not what? know about this either? Sam Bankman Freed? Nope. Oh my god. <laughs> I, I thought I wouldn't have to talk about it, or I wouldn't be able to talk about it because Yahoo. um I assumed everyone knew about it. No. We can't do this. Again. <laughs> okay. Um Sam Bankman Freed. He was the owner of uh the second Could biggest I just say? crypto exchange. But he sounds like kind of like a serial killer name. I could see him. I don't think he, he's a serial killer. But I think, like, if he gets caught, he would shoot everyone in the head and then shoot oh, himself. Oh, that's an interesting... <laughs> okay, that's, that's an interesting question. Like, what would be his, like, serial killer, like, signature? Uh, you know how, like, every killer has, yeah. like, a Yo, signature? Okay. Wait, we can do this after I explain the drama. And then we'll okay, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. So, he owns this company named FTX. It was the... At the time, it was the second biggest crypto exchange. And TSM famously did a partnership where they changed their entire fucking name to TSM FTX. It was that big of a partnership because they were supposed to get like $20 million, which is massive. Oh, wow. Or is it a million or billion? Probably a million. Billion's like insane. Or 80 million? I don't know. Lots of money for an esports org. Um, but FTX was exposed for fraud because they were spending their customers' money on really dumb shit. Mm. Um, and obviously, a lot of people got to dunk on crypto. A lot of people got to do all this shit. And uh, Sam Bankman Freed, there's, there's a lot of like funny individual stories. <laughs> Crypto to the moon, Crypto to the moon <laughs> baby. <laughs> have you seen Dogecoin to the moon? Have you seen that one FTX? There's a fucking hilarious FTX ad where um. Hold on, let me pull it up. Okay, so here's the ad. Oh, this I is love how we're, we're we just went from slamming reaction content to doing more reaction this content. This is barely reaction <laughs> content. Okay, <laughs> fuck the you. Squabblers, <laughs> hypocritical podcast. The hypocrite podcast. All right. Oh yeah. Finish it up. Like I was saying, it's FTX. It's a safe and easy way to get into crypto. Yeah, I don't think so. And I'm never wrong about this stuff. Never. <laughs> what a shit ad. That's so fucking funny. Wow. Like, I, I, I don't think crypto's going to go Larry, why would I you agree so. to do that? <laughs> don't be like Larry. Larry. Oh, my God. It's, it's huh? so, I'm not going to lie. 
it's really funny. Like, you put all your shit into crypto. Like, what do you expect, bitch? You know? Well, I think I do know what they expect. They expect fat stacks, fat hoes. <laughs> And that's it. What are, you, what, what are you giggling about? What are you giggling about over I there? I just didn't AC? expect that. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, like fat sandwiches. Crypto. Yeah, fat. You could buy fat sandwiches with, with fat all that stacks. Crypto. Yeah. With all that crypto all money. That fucking. If we were to do the the letter in the the word thing with crypto, come on, really? Why? What? Please. I'm I'm lost. It's a, you know, like the letters. Oh, an anagram. Yeah, an anagram. No. I just said anagram. Fucking dumb. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what the word was. Yeah, because you're cringe and stupid. But okay, no, uh, FTX right. fell. There's all this like stuff about um, like his girlfriend ran another company, and I think like he gave the funds from FTX to that company to like Alameda or something, and then they they used that money on dumb shit, and they lost other company cu- customers' money, and that is <laughs> fraud. Um, but now they went to court. This is a spicy part. So his girlfriend, and I'm pretty sure his best fucking friend, um, talked against Sam Bankman Fried the other day. Oh, they testified? Oh, yeah. They, they, they're in court now. It's oh, now. yikes. It's, nice. This is breaking news. And it's so funny <laughs> hearing, them, hearing them talk about like all the fraud that happened at, at, at FTX. And I think they said the maximum that he could go, he could go to jail for uh, was like thirty years. Thirty. He got a three, three zero. zero. And he's not a, he's not a young guy. I, I don't think. Maybe maybe he's young. How old is he? He's like twenty five, maybe. Oh wow. I think I don't think he's that old. Maybe. But it's funny because like, so in court, his biggest defense that he has is okay. I ran FTX. I invested it in Alameda, and Alameda uh, Alameda sh- sh- fucked it all. And lost the customer's money. So it's not our fault. It's Alameda's fault. Mm-hmm. The problem is, this guy tweets all fucking day. Uh, okay? So he'll be like, so they'll be like, oh, uh, this thing happened. What do you have to say? Well, actually, it was like this. Scroll through his Twitter. Complete opposite. Are you serious? He can't lie about shit because he tweets too much. Hmm. He's so relatable. Oh, my God. No. I mean. No. 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 Just don't use... X. He's 31 Don't years old. X. Don't use any it's kind of It's not Twitter anymore, people. It's X. Fuck you. Um, <laughs> he's 31 years old. If he gets 30 years, he's going to come out of old fucking Damn. man with zero bank. He's going to come out with, like, gray hairs and a hunchback and a cane. And a loose asshole. And a fucking veteran's discount. Damn, that's crazy. A veteran's discount that he can't use because he doesn't have the money to buy shit. Because uh, all his money is, uh... Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Well, yeah. it's digital. I mean, he lost it all. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> In 30 Which years, he's going to be trying to pay at, like, McDonald's with, like, Ethereum and yeah. Dogecoin. And, and, and it doesn't even exist anymore. <laughs> Could you imagine, like, he comes out of jail. He has no idea about the outside world. He's like, "Can excuse me, sire. Could I buy a Big Mac for uh, two Ethereum? <laughs> and they're just like, that's not what it's called anymore. And you're old. <laughs> plus Facts. you're old. Plus ratio, plus bald. Yeah, honestly. But no, um, I, I don't know too much about the details, so I can't go that much more in depth. Because, I mean, I, I could say some other things, but I'm not 100%, so I don't want to. Um, but yeah, big uh, fuck you to crypto. Woo! I think, uh, are, are, isn't like all crypto down now? Crypto From what it bad. was, yeah. I don't hear any talk about crypto anymore. No. Or like you know NFTs what? or anything like that. Yeah. Like, you know what it's changing to? Yeah. Government electronic monies. So like credit cards. Like bank what? accounts, credit cards. Oh, bank I, saving I, accounts. I guess, but didn't those exist before crypto? Yeah. I hate this guy. <laughs> <laughs> just straight up, I just fucking hate this. I guy. don't. Yeah, I really. I would. I did not know where you were going with that. I don't know where I was going with that either. To be fair. Um. Oh. oh. Okay. Okay. Can I tell you when I, someone first explained crypto to me? Mm-hmm. I thought it meant like. <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> like when you get coins in like video games and it <laughs> equates to real money. What? <laughs> so like, okay, someone explained it to me when I was like 10 or something and I was yeah. or something yeah, like that. I was right. super that's, I think that's about right. that's young about right. and like, I was like, 
Oh, so if you get coins in like Subway Surfers, that equates to like real money. <laughs> Bro, and they're like, baller. yeah, kind of. And I'm like, that's so Wait, baller. Who said who I don't remember. It had to be another grinding? child that told you. It this. was probably like Did a child. You just chi start grinding Subway Surfers or like Mario. Yes, or I started. <laughs> dude, you know, they came out in 2013 with New Super Mario Bros. 2 on the <gasps> DS, oh, which is a game all about bank. coins. So made I made bank. mad. Bank. Wow. I think I have finished with like over six hundred thousand coins in that game. Still waiting which, on the returns. Yeah, where's hey, hey, where's never my sell. returns? Never sell. <laughs> Do not sell. Okay. I'm not selling. Hold. I'm holding. It's going to the. It's gonna go room. up. It's Super gonna go Mario up. Mario Bros. Two. My Mario coins are gonna go Mario to the moon. Mario coin to the fucking moon. Also, I have to censor my foot. This has been on the wrong. Oh my goodness. Nah, -uh, not free. It's not free. It's censored. Mm -mm. Got to pay for it. Wow. <laughs> you got to pay for it. That's the perks of actually being on the pod. Yeah, the boys get to see the What are the, the few perks of being on the pod? <laughs> we get, yeah, we get to see the, the, the boys footsies, see the doggies. The of toes. Course, of course. Yeah. Um, I think the first time I heard about crypto, my friend Zach, uh, who's a big tech guy, he was like, bro, my Ethereum went up. And, like, his, his I'm pretty sure his account was, like, point zero 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 one five six like, Ethereum. I'm like, what the fuck are you going to do with that? Yeah. And then I realized, you know, one Bitcoin or one Ethereum is, like, $10,000. I'm like, okay, that's kind of sick. Um, oh, I have... Okay, no, I can't talk about that. Whoopsies. Um, <laughs> it's something completely different. It, it's, uh, I think it would call a little too much family drama. So I'm going to throw it to the side. Wait, Anyways. what? Um, I'll, I'll tell you about the, the car back. <laughs> it's, it's really funny. It's really funny, but I don't want to like cause some shit. You okay. Know, for like for dumb reasons, but um, I was gonna say, I I, I think uh, Zach was an interesting guy. I hope he's listening. I miss you, Zach. I love you, but I, I do. I've got to tell you this. Story. You heard it here first, folks. He loves you, Zach. Yeah, every Zach, by the way. Everybody named every Zach. Zach, that's Zach spelled Z A K. Zach spelled Z A C H. C H was C H boy. What? Zach was a C H. Oh, he's a, he's a C H boy. I have a Zach who's a C H boy. Love you. My first cousin. Shout Love out. you, Adam's first cousin. His name is actually. Oh wait, I can't say that. I should. I don't know. I don't want to give his full name. Then don't give his full name. But it's funny because like he has the same name as like right, another fine, it. famous it. person. We'll censor it. Zach, the quarterback. Okay, that's like that's like the most fucking ba like basic last name. I know. <laughs> but, uh, anyways, so my friend Zach, we. Uh, we both did the TV um, program for uh, for our school, and I feel kind of bad because like I'm not even saying this to inflate my own ego. Like I was heads and shoulders like the most popular person on there, which is great for my ego. Um, when are you not? Huh? When are you not the most popular person? Yeah, shit. I mean, like I'm on every short. You yeah, know, you're in every short. Yeah. He's a middle guy. What are you trying Sam's to get? Sam's not from having him? this. What are you trying to get from him? You're gassing There's him up There's nothing right wrong now. with a little glazing. You're meat riding him right yeah, now. He, he wants to be glazed. Doing flips on the I'm dick right you. now. Yeah, you're glazing me, and, and, and Shit, by I'm that just, I'm point, being smart. You're I'm being smart. All right, anyways. Oh, oh my, my God. God. Shut the fuck up, Leo. <laughs> my payment <laughs> details changed for Spotify. I didn't deliberately kick you out. Uh, f fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> by the way. Um, oh, that is super loud. I'd be pissed, too, if I got logged out of Spotify. Can you imagine getting logged out of Spotify at any given moment? I think I'd like. To oh, just end please, it. don't do not log me out of Spotify. I think I just ended at any given yeah, moment. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what I'd do after that. Oh, wait, he's gonna say hello. He's gonna say hello. This ping, this ping is hello. Holy crap! Come on, Leo, say it. But up. Where is it? Hey! hey! Shout out, Leo. Shout out, Leo. Uh, anyway, sorry, I'm gonna have to go in D and D. I think I don't know him. Um, Could be weird. Yeah, it would be. Probably not weirder than me. Oh yeah, you're th you're the weirdest one here. Oh, absolutely. Do a little silly goofy shit right now while Lance is texting. Okay. Anyways, uh, what was I saying? <laughs> Bro, Leo ruins everything. <laughs> Leo was also uh, he was he, he was also a uh, a guy on the on the fucking TV thing. Oh yeah. It was us two. We were the we were the duo. We kissed live on camera. Really? No. Oh, that's so. Oh. <laughs> that would have been so funny. Um, but anyways, oh, I've got to tell you. A story that's related to Leo and I kissing. Anyways, um, <laughs> <laughs> um, so I feel really bad telling the story, but we're hanging out, and sometimes people will approach me and be like, "Oh, Lance, can I fucking get a photo with you?" Whatever. It was pretty sparse, but it was cool. And they would play the the show. They'd play the most recent show on 
the TVs in our cafeteria. Yeah. And Zach was in the rotation, and I, I wasn't on the rotation. I was in the control room. So he's on the TV, and we're both eating lunch, talking, eating lunch, whatever. And they're like, oh, Lance, can get a photo in front of him. As his face is on the TV, they ask me for a photo. Wow. And not wow. him. And I felt so, I felt so fucking bad. Damn. Oh, you, my he's God. He's got to be B-list if they didn't even want to. No, play. it was, it, no, Zach got too much shit. It was kind of, it was actually kind of gross. Like, he was a little cringe sometimes, but, like, that was his worst crime. He was a nice guy. He was a very nice guy. You know? Yeah. Like, like me. um. Well, um, yeah, but but <laughs> instead of being cringe, sometimes you're cringe all the time, and I fucking hate you. And I wish yes. You Yippee! Yippee! Um. Anyways, <laughs> on, the, on the subject of Leo and I kissing, <laughs> um, it was me. It was Christmas Eve, and we were under. We were out by the fireplace, and everyone was I asleep. Saw Lancey kissing Leo Claus. Cut that! <laughs> what Cut that! The, no, no, no! The, the that people need to know that this happened. <laughs> that we had to go through that. <laughs> oh, that's the clip they're gonna use for a song, if anything. Holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> and, and that whole thing is the bass shop. It's like ah. <laughs> no, no, no. That, that voice was ridiculous. That's the voice that uh, she uses in the song. The like. To mimic the little kid, like the little boy. You, of course, you'd want to mimic little boys. <laughs> okay, well, you didn't have. To, I think that really says it all. Right there. Got him, got him. Anyways, that uh, really says it all. I was at prom. No, Kaylee's the one that likes kids, not me. Wait, can we? Okay, can wait, we make hold that on, a short? Hold on, guys, hold on. Can we make that a short and then say "Meet Sam" is the title <laughs> meet of the short. Meet Sam. <laughs> I like kids. <laughs> 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 Let me get to this fucking story. So Leo and I, uh, we're, we're at prom, not together. He has a girlfriend. Leo and but I, you still kiss? <laughs> Can't even blame you. That's awful. Leo and he was I, a handsome man. I don't know. He is a handsome man. Okay. No, so, so we go to prom. Leo and I are there. And there's like this little dance circle, right? And people are dancing, doing their shit. And I'm like, I can't dance, but I can make jokes. So what I did, I grabbed like a roll of bread that they were giving out. I ran to the middle of the circle and I started fucking hyping people up. Like, yeah, yeah. I, I held the bread up and I hyped everyone up. They're like, yeah, fucking yeah. eat it. <laughs> put it in my mouth. They're like, yeah. And I left. I'm like, oh, that's really funny. Dude, that's so hype. Leo fucking runs up to me and just bites the bread out of my mouth and their bottom lips touch. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> so your first kiss. My first kiss was with a man. That boy so w. fucking funny. That boy <laughs> wanted something more than just bread. Yeah. Uh, he wanted he wanted my bread. He wanted a bread Yo. winner. He, he wanted a he, bread winner. <laughs> he wanted to share bread. That's true. In marriage. I know yes. I know Leo. I know. I know. You don't have to hide it. Leo. I don't blame him. That don't was blame him. Some sneaky tactics. <laughs> it was so. It was so. That was a little, <laughs> sneaky like a dog. tactic. He's such a sly oh, dog. Oh, it, it was such a fucking funny night. Um, have I kissed any other men? <laughs> uh, I don't know. I, I got kissed on the cheek by a uh, non-binary individual. I was at a um, I was at a graduation party, and we we're hanging out, and like we had we had very similar like like all the the person I'm friends with like we don't see each other that much, but we have like very similar sense of humor. And by you know translation, their friends have similar sense of humor as I. And we'd make all these fucking jokes about how hot each other <laughs> we thought each other were. Uh, we made all these fucking jokes, and uh, he had, uh, they ended up kissing me on the on the cheek. It's really funny. Let's go. So fucking dub. funny. That's such a dove. Yeah, I, I, dude. You've been if, kissed everywhere, huh? If only I was gay, bro. I'd be such a good gay lover. <laughs> dude, I know you would. I think about that all the time. <laughs> oh, yo, uh, I was joking. Yo, yeah, I'm, a, I, I, I'm a very straight man. I, I love women, as you can see. As you can see. As you can see. From your your. Kissing one in the mouth stories. Yeah, you, cause, uh, cause I'm practicing. That's a good point. I'm practicing. Are you like a, Are you a super straight person? I only straight as a pencil. I only look at women. I what? never You're looked at no at man. man right now. Never looked at no man ever. Mm -mm, no man. No man. No man. You're not looking at men right now, <laughs> <laughs> bitch. <laughs> uh, Why'd you look at me when you said that? Because you literally just said you're talking to men right now. I'm a fucking idiot. You're yeah, right. <laughs> yeah that, that's the conclusion i'm trying to get you to reach um welcome thank to the adam is slow podcast thank you for helping me realize that. <laughs> we're bullying basic. a tired man <laughs> feel bad it didn't feel good um but yeah i don't think i don't think i've kissed any other men you don't think mm -mm. it, it could have happened it could still happen 
It could still that happen. Hey, I'm hey, not... any, we don't know if we're promised tomorrow, and we don't know if we're promised to be straight tomorrow. That's true. Yeah. That's a good point. Any day you could wake change up in a and day. Be gay. Any day you could wake true. up and be dead. <laughs> All right. Uh, uh, what's next? Yeah, let's talk about that. <laughs> it's yeah, an hour. Elaborate on that. Yeah, so uh, we're all gonna die. We're all gonna die. We're all we're gonna, gonna die. die. We're all gonna die. The inevitable march of time. So we get closer to our demise. Ballad of the <laughs> dying <laughs> man. That's a great segue. That's 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 the sound I want to hear when I die. What? Are you <laughs> why that specifically? I can't. Why not? Why not give a me variation? A reason. Give, give me a reason. Why not? Why not more a more somber version? Because that's not as fun. Are you going to die while you're playing Mario Kart? Is that what you're implying? Oh, my God. That's how I want to go out. You know how people are like, the best way to die would be in your sleep, surrounded by loved ones. Bro, the, the way I want to die is getting a sub two-minute run on TikTok clock. I'm still playing Mario Kart. Nothing's changed. I was playing Mario Kart during my criminology class. Yeah. <laughs> Granted, it was. <laughs> I, I'm lying a bit when I say that. Criminology started at 11.15. She wasn't there at 11.15. I played. She got here at 11.17. And then I stopped. No, you played the game through her entire lecture. Okay, don't fucking tell him. Okay, we have to cut. We're going to censor that. Admit but, it. okay, hold on. <laughs> okay, agree with me. So, but yeah, she stopped at 11.17. <laughs> um, you were there. Yeah. Yeah, he saw it. Yeah. Uh huh. It's true. Okay, well, who were you playing as then? I was still playing as Isabel. Nothing's changed. <laughs> oh. Oh, the the one that uh, the short that got two thousand views. Sheesh! Oh, oh that's yeah. right. Uh, thank you, YouTube views. crowd. We love you, YouTube. Kisses. We love you more than anyone else, unless you're listening on Spotify. If you're listening on Spotify, we love you more than anyone else. Yeah, no. Unless you're listening on Apple. Spotify which, listeners based. If you're listening on Apple, oh, we love you. Spotify you listeners. Spotify. I do have Spotify. I do. Spotify better than Apple Music. That's not even a hot take. To is some it? people, it is. Is it? You'd be surprised. There's a really? lot of people that like Apple Music more than Spotify. Okay, what are the differences, though? I don't use either. I don't know. I just remember, like, 10 years ago, going on Apple Music and not having a subscription to it. And all the songs were, like, $4 individually. Are you serious? Yeah, they were all, like, 3 4 wait, bucks wait, wait, individually. Wait, wait, what year? Unless you bought the album, it was, like, in, 20 bucks. In what year? Uh... I don't know, 2016? How? Music's free. I don't know. Yeah, you can just stream. Go to YouTube. 2015? I don't know. I don't know. But I remember not having a subscription going on Apple Music, and it was like that. It was like That's three, weird. four bucks for a song. That is weird. At least yeah. with Spotify, you could listen to it free. Mommy, could I listen to No, stop. Stop, <laughs> okay. stop, stop. You go to jail. Go to jail. <laughs> You're going to don't jail. Pa don't, don't pass go. Don't, don't, okay. don't take $200. Fucking go to jail. Yeah. No, nope, going to jail. No bail. I ain't visiting Bye. you. I wouldn't want you to. I'd visit. Damn, that was a test. You failed. <laughs> I would visit, and I'd give you a big cake with like a comically Fine. large What's bomb that? in it. <laughs> so you so can so like can kill himself. So you can like tiptoe over to the side and like light it, and then get like a cartoony explosion that <laughs> sneak out. Oh my god! And, no, I've always wanted to do that. Well, the Why sheriff. They do that in the Shawshank? sheriff is right next to your cell, like. <laughs> Just of sleeping. course, the sheriff would be a Mimi. Alcatraz me, 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 ain't got shit on this uh, <laughs> the bomb, bomb cake. prison escape. But there, there's a catch. There's a catch. When the bomb goes off, you have to go. With, with, oh. Well, yeah. You have yeah. to cover your fucking ears and go. I do. And your ears will be fine. And, and then, out. yeah, as soon as the wall opens. You run so fast, you leave your hat floating in the air. And then you reach and back. Then and then off camera, you, you reach, reach back, back grab, grab it, and then run again. Yeah. yeah. You sound exactly. a lot like Drake right now. <laughs> I knew, I knew that was coming. I knew that was coming. Yo, you don't know about that? No. Okay. Drake so the type of guy. The Drake the type of guy memes. You know about the Drake the type of guy memes, right? No. You don't know about the Drake no. the type of guy memes? Okay, so they originally started off, like they, I'd say they were like one of the first popular actual first popular like group of memes. Um, they originally started off as like making fun of drake's like emotions and softness oh and my shit God. <laughs> and they were like, drake the type of guy to like i don't know this is like call his ex or whatever the fuck to love his kids to love his kids and then but now they've turned into like cartoon shit like drape the, <laughs> drape the type of guy to like float towards the scent of a pie when he <laughs> oh <laughs> drake the kind of guy to run off a cliff and not notice gravity until he lance down. you have yeah. to see the image adam sent me the other day <laughs> an ai generation of Drake floating 
to a pie. <laughs> oh, <no. Here>. <laughs> 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 oh, I saw that. And I was that like, that's perfect. Put it up. <laughs> oh, that's so fucking funny. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm just gonna screenshot it and I'll yeah, send it to yeah, you. Yeah. Yeah, um, they'll, they'll range from anything from like drink the type of guy to like fall in the tiger cage and go nice kitty. Nice kitty. <laughs> it's like it's well, I don't understand it, it's but it's like so funny. It though. is kind of funny. It is funny. Oh my god, Drake the kind of guy. What are more? What are, there's gonna be some more like unknown cartoon things that we don't talk about. Like right. uh, fuck, I'm trying to think of one right now. I'm flopping. I'm flopping. I'm gonna be real. I'm a, I'm in my flop era. I fell off. Your flop off. You, you felled it off. I felled it off. I can't I think of anything. I need to watch more cartoons. I, I, I actually, there's cartoon a lot, there's tropes. A, there's a lot of stuff I want to watch. That yeah. I just like. Oh, oh well, I know there's too. that new like Adventure Time stuff oh, that's been going wait, on. What? I've been seeing a lot of clips. It's been going around on wait, Twitter. New like new season of Adventure Time. No, but it's like a. It's like or a con continuation with different characters. Yeah, how I did, honestly how did don't. Because wouldn't it, I don't know. I th oh fuck I don't, I don't remember either. It's something with the Ice King. Yeah, I well, I know I it got remember. super, like, serious in the later got, seasons. Like, it went deep into, like, bro. Ice King's backstory and everything All like right, that. So yeah. If, if This is kind of like a debate. If you could pick one of three, Adventure Time, Regular Show, Gumball, or rank them, actually. You didn't even include my rank? favorite. What? You didn't, even include, you didn't include the goat. You missed the goat. What's the goat? You missed the goat. What's the goat? Is there, is there a hint in this room? I don't. I don't think I have a hint up. Oh, I, I have the. Okay. I swear to God, if you say SpongeBob. No. Okay. Okay. I mean, okay. I've never seen okay. SpongeBob. SpongeBob and I feel alienated. SpongeBob is one of the goats, but it's not like the goat. Okay. okay. What's the goat? Gravity Falls. Gravity Falls is the goat. See? Oh my That's God. true. Oh. That's true. Oh, thank God. You, it's you, so good. You got back in my good graces. It's so good. Okay. Also, over the garden wall. I wish I watched anybody. that more. I, I wish I watched never that watched more. that. Never that watched that. Made that. my childhood. There's um. There's one that's week. There's one that's out. Right now, that I kind of want to watch. It looks good. Um, it's called Owl House. I've oh, heard, like, I have seen stuff about Owl, that. Owl yeah, House? Owl House. Like, it, I mean, it's a kids' cartoon, but it's actually pretty good. People say it's good. Yeah, like my, my buddy Mira introduced me to that one. If I had to pick one of three, so what was it again? Gumball like, Adventure Time Gumball, or Adventure regular, time, show? regular Show? Regular Show. You, you said rank them. The three juggernauts. One, right? Rank them. Regular, regular Show. Hard. Gumball. For me, it's pretty easy. Hold on. Regular, sorry, one more. Regular Show. Gumball. What was it? Adventure Time? Adventure Time, yeah. The problem is I didn't watch them all equally. That's, That's my biggest true. issue. I watched a lot of them. Like, I didn't watch... Oh my god, I gotta think. I watched all of these. But I, I, I think I watched Adventure Time the least, unfortunately. I really yeah. wish I watched it more. Well, I think Regular Show was the one I absolutely loved. I loved it too. Like, that was... I'd, I'd rewatch it. <laughs> um, Adventure Time, I'd rank second, because I, I really liked it. Sometimes it got, like, a little bit too... Just fucking weird. weird. For yeah, me. no, I know. What you're <laughs> yeah, there's some true. scenes. Um, there's some scenes. There's some scenes, but it overall, you know, still really interesting. Gumball, I never really got into. There's some episodes that I like, but I don't know. I found it like the least creative of the three, probably. Um, okay. I think the thing is, I watched Gumball the most, and I'd probably rank it the lowest because, like, I remember it being very good, and then I rewatched it recently. Like, I didn't like go, I didn't sit down and rewatch all that. Right. But like, I would go to a very legal streaming service, and I would watch it uh, in the background while I do shit. Um, and like, there are some apps I just, I just did not want to watch. Um, Adventure Time. I, I think I agree with you. Adventure Time second. Like, I think it's very good. I wish I stuck it out to the end because I think. Like the ending, from what I remember, is really fucking sick. Right. It's really sad. I feel like the end, like the end of, like these, uh, of like a Titan cartoon like show that was initially just like dumb fun for kids, always got to end with something ex existential. Yeah, you it know? does. That, that it's, is it's how it usually It's such a shame happens. that gra uh, I think Gumball ended on like season six, and they wanted to keep going, and they weren't able to. Really. I think it literally just like ended. That's a shame. Oh. I mean, the finale wasn't bad, but like you, they needed you. It wasn't supposed to end there, hmm. which sucks. Did Gravity Falls? Gravity Falls end? ended. Yep. Okay. Properly. Properly. It ended, ended in properly. S one, S two. S one okay. was very much um, episodic. Is episodic the word when an, where you, you you don't need to watch every episode to understand? Mm. Yeah, I think so. Sure, okay. I don't know. I don't know the word for it. All right, let's. You know what? For like the sake of this, like Breaking Bad, where you have to you need to watch, watch every serialized. episode. Serialized. That's serialized. Serialized, and then there's. Like more like friends where you could just like jump around. I think I think it's episodic. Okay. Okay. In the in, in the context of this YouTube video, episodic means 
when I say episodic, I mean something that you can watch and you don't need the context of past episodes to do it. Serialized means you need to know the, the story to keep up. Mm -hmm. So, um, they, like, Gravity Falls started off very episodic. You could, like, it was just the monster of the week. It was cool. It was fun. Alex Hirsch, the goat writer. Um, a lot of lore. Just lot, introduction. It's very... It, there's a lot of lore, but it's, like, it, it's it's lore that helps you learn about the universe. It's not like you need to know it to appreciate Oh, the yeah. Universe. Aren't there... Isn't, like, there's, like, the three books that yeah, they have I to have, find? Oh, I got, I got mine yeah. right fucking there. I got my copy. Journal oh, 3. Hold on. Journal I'll, I'll 3. Yeah, yeah. No, I was actually a dipper for Halloween one year. Were you really? Yeah, I have I have the pine hat and everything. Oh. oh I have them too. Do you really? Oh wow. Grunkle Stan. Okay, it's fucking disgusting, but it's right here. Oh my, that is dirty yeah, as hell. Yeah, mine is like fuck too. <laughs> I don't know if I even still have it. I probably do. I have a friend who kept the same blue hat for like twelve years, like first grade through. High school? High school. And he never threw it out. Oh, oh my god. And so, it's like so ripped, but nobody will let him stop wearing it. Oh, he wears it? Because I feel like he's... I don't, I, feel, I don't think he wears it through... He hasn't worn it in a few years, but he wore it all through high school, and it was like this ripped fucking thing, and nobody would let him take it off. I, f I feel like if you keep it around, like, it's fine. Like, I get it. Like, I, I probably have a tough time throwing this out. Right. Even though it's... it's oh, by the way, like, for audio listeners, this thing's fucking disgusting. It's dirty and shit. I don't even know how. It's, it, I literally just leave it up there. Like, I don't fucking touch this anymore. <laughs> just collected a bunch of dust. <laughs> All this muck. Um, it's more uh, show accurate now. Actually true. Okay, yeah. never mind. It's a feature. <laughs> it's a feature, not a yeah. bug. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'd wear th I I wore this for like a, a, a few months, and then I stopped because I didn't like wearing hats. Um, but this is my fucking crown of achievement. Well, well, it's there now. Oh, I should add it. I should add it to the set out of respect, but it's a little dirty. I'll probably buy a new one for the set. Um... This is journal number three, and if you don't understand the relevance of this, go fuck yourself. But also, <laughs> this is um, a book in Gravity Falls where uh, Dipper finds a mysterious book um, called Journal Three, and um, it has all these notes about all these like wondrous creatures in, in Gravity Falls. Um, and halfway through the book, it just stops because like the author mysteriously goes missing, and that's accurate in this book. So like, if you look at this, like. All the, I mean, okay, the camera can't really see it, but like, all the things are like in fancy writing from Ford, which is um, the owner Ooh. of the book. I should probably, uh, eh, it's, if you want to get it wrong. Do it's, we, it's a good show, even if you know how it ends. So watch it. Did they ever reveal who the author was? Yeah. Did you was not it, finish it? I did. It was a long time ago. Was okay. It, was it? It's Ford. It was Ford. His, okay. his, his, his uh, twin brother. Oh, okay. Yeah, By the way, right. this That's is, right. uh, I said this on the pod already, but like, a good barometer for if a show is good or not, if you can watch it even though you know how it ends and you still have a good time, mm. that means it's good. This fucking show is incredible. So yeah, that is. will hit That's that. That's true, yeah. We, I'm not going to spoil the very ending because the very end, end is fucking bananas, but... I just found out like a few days ago that it's, it was actually set in uh, Oregon. It was in Oregon, yeah. Did they ever say it in the show? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Huh. Um, or at least it was heavily implied. But like, so the, so the book will go from like... Oh my god. Yeah, did you see this shit? Look, my muse was a monster. Like all oh, this wow. fucking lore, um, and then it'll it it'll fucking it'll end. It ends with like this, like diagram of all these. I remember that weird shit. Yep. And then it just goes to blank, and then Dipper starts writing, and it's all this like cute cute drawings and oh, shit. Oh yeah, That's I awesome. dude, I read I I fucking read this book, I think like five times through. Actually, really, I love. Do you this remember? Book. One of the I don't remember like a ton of scenes from Gravity Falls, but one of my favorites was um you remember uh, Dipper in the bathroom singing uh, Dancing this, Queen? Yeah, but it's like or a rip disco off? girl. Yeah, disco girl. Yeah. It's like a different version. Like disco girl coming through. through. That girl is or or have, have have you have you seen um what's it called? Fucking Don't Start Unbelieving. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I love <laughs> them. The They're so versions. funny. They're, they were so good. They were oh, so good. I, oh my god! I miss, can we do? Can we? Can we watch like the whole thing sometime together? I, I want to binge through that shit. I so have not watched it. So you haven't watched You've it. You've never nope. watched. Oh Gravity my god! Falls. I hope you die no, in real life. You haven't seen everything god. ever all at <laughs> once. You haven't seen Gravity Falls. Like, what the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> Man, I just haven't seen it. Over the Garden Wall and Gravity Falls are essential watch. I haven't seen it. Over, over the Garden Wall. It's over the Garden Wall is ten episodes and they're like forty five minutes each. I think. I don't think Gravity you Falls could, is that long. You could really get through it if you try. Gravity Falls. 
season one and two. But no, this is unironically probably like the best kids TV show ever. Like I'm not I even gonna lie. So. Like yeah. I think I think SpongeBob is great and all, but like Gravity Falls just has the best of everything. Yeah, Gravity Falls is like elevated writing. So no, I've have heard very very good things about it. Seventeen hours and twenty six minutes. Okay, which isn't bad, honestly. For the it's whole series, terrible. that's not that bad. Um, or just season one. All of it. All of it. Okay, that's not that bad. Um, it. it I, I would. <sighs> I would. I would, I would do. Can we do that, dude? Sometime when, when, when there's not that many movies coming out, we should actually just hang out a weekend and fucking grind dude, it. Dude, I would be so down. I'm so down. Okay. Yeah. Um, we'll introduce Sam. Like, dude, there is some fire shit. Bill, when we get to Bill Cipher. Oh. Oh. Okay. My God. I'm not gonna I say more. Say what he is. I won't say, I won't what say is. more. When we get to Bill Cipher, I'm gonna lose my fucking. Oh no! Mind. I know what Bill Cipher is. Okay. Like, okay. Good. Yeah. Like the. The, the Illuminati, Illuminati the triangle guy. Man. Yeah. Triangle man. He was my profile picture for so long. Really? There's this there's this scrapped Bill Cipher song. But I can't show it because it kinda spoils something for mm. for, for Sam. Uh, okay, the theme song is super catchy. It's it is super oh, catchy. this is all I'm gonna think about. <laughs> Fuck. When I when we watch it, I'm gonna this nostalgia is gonna go. Dude, okay, I'm not. So crazy. You're you're gonna. It's gonna be miserable watching with me because I'm gonna freak the fuck out whenever I see anyone. <laughs> I'm gonna be like, oh, I remember this episode when I went to see something. The gnomes. The gnomes. Dude, Seuss. Seuss was also a great character. Seuss you know was what's great. funny? Gr- wait, 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 wait. What? There's just, there was like a. Remember that Seuss's mansion song? <gasps> now we blanching, now we blanching. I live, live up, up in, in a, a mansion. mansion. <laughs> now we. B- <laughs> oh, oh my, my god. god! Okay, so, okay. If you guys know any scientists that are researching nostalgia, send them this because this is a visceral reaction. It is. Oh my fucking god, dude! Sorry. Right? Sorry. This is the show. This show meant you so much. Going, you guys are going insane right, right now. This show meant yeah, so I, much. It's so you don't understand. No, it was one of my favorite shows of all time. I would sure. cry if I ever got to meet Alex Hirsch. He yeah. he's a big part of how I developed <laughs> as a human being. This isn't even. This is like half a joke. Like I say that to be. Uh, what's the word? To, for flair, but yeah. like, he's actually probably influenced me, so like in ways I don't know oh, about. Yeah, I bl- oh, yeah. that show's so good. Um, there's there's a version. Oh, I need to buy it now. There's a version of this book that comes with like the the blacklight version. Oh, because really? in the show, they find out this is a very minor spoiler. They find out that if you shine a black light on the journal, they, it would show secret things on the pages, uh. and they'd use that information for like things, right? Um, but the, uh, this isn't that version, unfortunately. I found that the hard way. I bought a blacklight. I'm like, oh my god, this is. I'm gonna. This book's gonna double in fucking value in my mind. Yeah. Flash it, nothing. Nothing. But there is a blacklight version. Yeah. I'm pretty sure. So I need to buy it. You do. Um, but it's funny because Alex Hirsch voices like half the characters. No, no, no. It's, it's not exactly that, but it's it's a good bit. It's he voices Grunkle Stan, Seuss, and Bill Cipher. That's crazy. Which is. Insane. The, the three different major characters. And oh. It's really funny when Grunkle Stan and Seuss talk to each other because in my mind I'm just like he's just talking himself in the booth. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. That is funny. There it's kind of like the the Clone Wars where like this one guy doing like a oh, million people. Oh yeah. Or Polar Express Polar where Tom Express. Hanks has Tom full Hanks on. was supposed to play every character. Yeah. That's, originally they wanted him to play every character. That's really funny though. I wish that happened. He almost he plays like five or six different characters. Okay, in that movie. if there's any animators out there that want to do stuff with us, <laughs> quick five minutes. Okay, five minutes in animation is like six years, but short thing. I'll voice everyone. I think that'd be so funny. It would be. That'd be really fucking. That would funny. be funny. Um, oh my god. Okay. I can't spill this now because this is actually a fire idea. Mine, I have an animation idea. I'll spill okay. it in the car. Such a good idea. Um, there's also a... There was a... Mm, fuck! Fuck! Sorry. Uh, there is a real-life ARG um, done with Gravity Falls where there was a real-life Bill Cipher statue like hiding somewhere in the States. No. Oh, that's cool. It was so Are sick. Are you serious? Yes. Did they find it? They found it. It took like seven days. It was, Where was it? It was it was somewhere in Oregon. Oh, that makes it's sense. Cute. Yeah, that's really cool. But but obviously, I mean, that was probably obvious. But like, Oregon's a big state, right? Uh, well, okay, it's it not is. a massive state, but like, it's, it's pretty. 
you can't walk through all of Oregon in a day. Right. Like, it's going to take, like, just oh, do yeah. energy. Also, you're cringe as fuck if you do that. Um, oh, you hate none of the Oregon trail walkers? Okay, I... <laughs> Oregon trail, oh my god. <laughs> all right. No, it was, um... It, there was this funny drama that happened during it, though, because the place that they hit it in, they obviously got um, permission from the owner, but there was a land dispute. So they didn't know whose land they could put it on. It's really funny. I don't think the person that found it would be allowed to keep. Maybe they were allowed to keep it. I don't know. But th- they came with a lot of like very cool Gravity Falls memorabilia. Yeah. That, bro, if you own that shit, reach out because I want to buy it from you. I don't have the money to buy it from you, but when I get the money, I'll buy it from you. Shit. I mean, we could turn into a Gravity Falls podcast. The problem is this has probably already been done, and they've probably sold something, That's and now true. it's private. And honestly, if someone, if I found out about this offer, I wouldn't even fucking put it up. I'll be real. Like, you would have to offer me, unironically, like a billion dollars. Yeah. Like, I'm like I'm not even playing. Like, I, I, I'm not sure that I'd, I'd accept a million. I'm being so dead ass. <sighs> Maybe, like, a few things. But, like, it, like, if you wanted everything for a million, I don't know if I could do that. Really? Like, I'm literally that attached. You don't I'll understand. I'll be real. Like, you don't understand. I'm not that attached. <laughs> I'm, no, I, you don't. Look at me in the fucking eyes. Like, th- like this show is unironically so much. Like, there's no, signed shit from Alex, and oh, it, so it, cool. It, it was my whole like creative interest for like a whole year. <laughs> <laughs> that was the only thing I really cared about for like a whole year. Um, but no, Gravity Falls is good, and um, and they they have a f- oh, they have the statue up in some like restaurant in Oregon, and it's so fucking cute. Bill Cipher statue, Oregon. Okay, where is it? Reedsport, Oregon, Forest. That's where it was. Um, I think it's a restaurant or whatever. But this is what it looks like. Just hanging up. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, that's neat. It's that so really adorable. Cool. He's just there. He's a little man. Looks scary. Um, I don't know if Alex Hirsch was doing anything. I, um, he, he was he was involved with a lot in Disney. Um, and then Gravity Falls happened, and I think he did a bit more than he left. Or or at least didn't do much. Okay, you get to meet Alex Hirsch or the Daniels. Fuck you, fuck yourself. <laughs> um, <laughs> Which one? Fuck. You can only meet one of them. Everything, everywhere. The other one you will never meet in your life. Fuck. Yeah, yeah, you can't meet the other one if you choose. Probably the Daniels. Yeah. Everything everywhere else means way more. Yeah. Which is surprising. That's like, cool. like, uh, like Gravity Falls made my childhood, and then, like, everything everywhere all at once... Unironically, has like changed my life. Like, <laughs> like made everything. Like, 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 like legitimate. L- l- I said this earlier. I started treating people nicer. Yeah. After, <laughs> after I watched that movie, I, cr- I, I, I'm not the kind of guy to rewatch stuff all the time. Like, yeah, something has to be very good for that to happen. And even if it happens, it's usually in the background. Like with the with the boys, I loved it. I, I'll have it in the background while I like play Minecraft or something. Yeah. Right. Everything, ever all once, I sat down and watched five times. Everything, everywhere, I saw in theaters at least twice. Oh, Which is I never saw it in theaters. Not never once. Never saw it in theaters. Not once. Wait, oh, and it's your favorite God. movie you never seen in theaters? The first time I watched that's it, that's an L. The, that's a major. It L. came back in theaters, and I didn't fucking watch it. That was the biggest. Oh, one. That's oh the biggest one. Wait, why, my why God! Not? I don't know, bro. Did you see it, Sam? <laughs> no, I've never seen it. Yeah, that, that's, uh, yeah, he hasn't watched Gravity Falls or that movie. You have to. Dude, you okay, have we to have. Watch we'll it. watch that for the for the birthday when, when it's my birthday week for the podcast. All right, yeah, we'll we'll definitely do that. I I will say that. We're gonna talk about nothing else. Like I could talk. I'm I'm being so dead ass. I gotta talk about this movie for like eight hours. Did no, we'll talk about it. We'll year. definitely talk about it. 2022. Oh wow, it's been a while. I thought it came out like early this year. Um, yeah, no, because they, they the reason it came back in theaters because it was this, its year old anniversary. Mm. Um, fuck, sorry. I'm thinking, okay. Now you guys got me thinking about Gravity Falls and everything ever all at once. Like I can't handle this. <laughs> I, I love these it's things. Too good. I mean, they're both incredible. Um, but no, everything, ever, all at once. Uh, what were we talking about? <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking Yo, about? this is like Fast Clown, but for Lance. Oh, what are we talking yeah. about? Yeah. <laughs> what are we, what are we about? Lance is Fast Clown. What are, we, what are we talking about? Everything, ever, all at once is good. Oh, yeah. I'd be the Daniels. Yeah. Because, like, I, I, they, I don't know. They changed, like, they've literally changed right. the and course Right, and also, of my you've life. talked about having them on the pod, like, a million times. I would... I would go into fucking bankruptcy to get them on here. I believe it. I'd throw away every bag you've ever made. You'd, you'd end the whole pod just to talk to them. If they're like, okay, we'll be on, but you can't make any episodes ever again. I'll be like, boys, it's a good run. <laughs> <laughs> Let's good run. fucking do it. We go out no, with a bang. 
Uh, right, that is true. Instead of falling off randomly and just ending the pod, we end it with the fucking Daniels. Imagine someone starts watching the Squabblers. It's like, oh, it's only six episodes. What? They got the Daniels on? They never made another episode. <laughs> I would assume that they just peaked and they're just like, we can't make anything else. If we make something else, it'll be shit. Yeah. In comparison. Yeah. You know? Oh, my. I love, I love the Daniels. If, any, if, if you're the Daniels or you know the Daniels or you know someone who knows the Daniels and so on and so forth. Sometimes you just peak at six episodes. That, exactly. That, I mean, we could. We're only at number four. We're they, getting close to the peak, then. Yeah, uh, hey, okay, but that means the Daniels get on. <sighs> Shit. Okay, what well, is this it? is our opportunity. It would be... this, is, this is our trolley problem. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> a trolley is coming for your podcast. You can pull the lever, but you don't get to hang out with the Daniels. With the Daniels. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, that might be the hardest one yet. Mm-hmm. No, I, like, literally, uh, I'm going to put a photo on it on screen now, uh, but for audio listeners, I literally have... How do I look at your screen when you say that? You're such a fucking dumbass. Uh, <laughs> I, I have... <laughs> I, I have a big-ass... Uh, well, uh, no, we'll start with the small stuff first. I, I have the actual DVD set for everything ever all at once. I have the collector's edition DVD set, um, a poster that came with the DVD set, a, a fucking book about taxes, uh, which is related to oh, everything ever all at once. Wow. Um, oh, my God. I have a pet rock right here from the movie. Um, I'm getting chills. I, um, I have. I forgot. Oh, right there, the um, uh, a vinyl of the f- soundtrack. Um, I think I'm forgetting something. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, it's sick. It I, really cool. And um, and the biggest thing is, the the song "This Is a Life" was made by Mitski and Son Lux specifically for the movie, and that's I I see that every single day. It's hanging above my display. Shout um, out Mitski. Shout out Mitski. My out sister's so favorite artist is yeah. Mitski. Yeah. Um, and it's just all these photos with my friends, and it reminds me that I'm loved. It's so cool. That's, That's deep. So cool. That yeah, no, it's deep. nice. That's cool, though, yeah. yeah. Uh, I was, was going to ask a question. Ask it then, bitch. I forgot. There's you something about everything everywhere. Oh, man, I could answer it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure you could. Uh, no, just keep going. I'll think of it. I want to know, like, so when did this movie come out? Like, I, I want to know. Early 2022? I want to know. I should know this wow, off so the rip. it's super should, recent. Oh, do you have the 4K? Is there a 4K? Uh, probably, because I bought the official versions. So, like, it's probably, it's probably, like, the highest def. Huh? I can't imagine, like, some ripoff having a better quality. That would be bananas. Imagine. <laughs> you bet- don't have the, um, the Vegas sphere. I know we were talking about this on, yeah. you know, the other pod. Um... But the Vegas Sphere, apparently they introduced like an 18K screen. Oh, yeah. I see. Oh, like, I heard our, about our that. Our eyes are, can only like take it in because the screen's so big. Mm-hmm. Oh, wow. On, on, on video, it's like it doesn't look like anything. But I'm sh- like in person, it apparently crazy. it's like the most incredible thing ever. You know what's funny? You can rent out that sphere for one day for 450K or for a week for 650 to, like, A put week? Something on. I would think it would be more. Right? Yeah, yeah. I would have right. thought it would have been more. Let's pull our resources <laughs> Dude. What would we even do with it? <laughs> air, not... We air an episode of the Squabblers podcast All day? on the Yo. sphere. They would hate us. Vegas <laughs> would fucking hate seeing our dumbass faces after an hour. <laughs> the, on the outside? Yeah, I'm saying the outside. We'd actually get famous that way. <laughs> okay, we that get, would be awesome. Okay, okay, we would get famous, but the problem is we get famous and people are just like, I hate seeing your goddamn face every day on my commute to work. Well, I hope you die in real life. It's <laughs> renting it the same as getting the the outside screen because there's a theater No, 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 inside. you're paying for the outside. The thing oh. that I listed is the outside. I'm pretty okay. sure. I don't think – I think the inside is like completely fucking different. Right. Um, by the way, everything ever all, all, all at once, March 11, 2022. March 11. Okay. March 11th. What is it, uh, what is it about? Yeah, you should probably talk about that. <laughs> Just yeah. like basic okay. plot synopsis. Quick, quick. Summarize it. So basically, um, uh, listen. I know the synopsis. So okay. Um, yeah, I I I wouldn't expect there to be, be even be a synopsis. It's hard. It's hard. Michelle Yeoh, who uh, plays the character Evelyn uh, Wang, she is uh, like an older Asian woman who came from China, and she married a man named uh, Raymond Wong. Wang. Raymond Wang. And uh, this laundromat, it's like, you know, it's it's busy, it's stressful, you know. And um, she's unhappy in her marriage. And it's all, like, and, and her life is, like, kind of, all, all her foundations are very shaky. Like, her relationship with her daughter and her dad, it's all very, it's all kind of fucked. 
Mm-hmm. Um, but then suddenly, um, a, a dimension hopper is the way, best way to put it. It's, it's technically verse jumping, but you don't know that. A uh, dimension hopper named uh, uh, Alpha Wayman comes to their universe. And the way it works in Everything Ever All Once is that you can verse jump to jump to another version of yourself in a different multiverse to take over their body. Oh, interesting. So that happens, and he's like, oh, this force named Jobu Tupaki is taking over, is, is trying to destroy the multiverses, and I need you to help us. Oh, yeah. Int- and it's okay. sick. Okay, I know this sounds... Like, you hear multiverse, and you hear, like... Yeah, so yeah I was gonna I was gonna be like, multiverse. No, I sounds- promise, I swear to fucking God, it's the best movie, period. Yeah, I mean, I mean, it's... it's I don't know if I'd put it in my top ten. I definitely put it in my top fifteen. To be to be fair, I think not even the top ten. Maybe top ten. Pro- Fuck probably you. top ten. I probably would. Yeah, I uh, just bullied you into <laughs> it. Yeah, wow, that's crazy. <laughs> um, no, you hear that and it's like, oh, but no, no like I, Marvel I, has obscured your. They yeah, one hundred percent, one hundred percent. The Daniels are worried about that. They're just like, fuck, because because they, they? they've they they've, they've been wanting to do multiverse shit for like ten years. Well, multiverse is not what that movie's about at all. Like it's no. just the vehicle. It's a part of it. Yeah. It's 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 a it's a vehicle. Sorry. No, you. <laughs> it, it, it's a part of the movie. It's a it's a tool for the movie to push along the plot to convey a different message. Message, and it, the message is sick. And I can't say it because it'll spoil everything. If if there's one, like okay, like I said, movies that get spoiled, that aren't worth your time. No, sorry, movies that if you spoil them, you don't want to like. There's no point in watching them. They're, they're not worth your time, right? This movie, if I spoil it. It'll suck a lot because, like, the, the it just means so much. But it's still a good movie. Right. So sure. fuck you and go watch it. <laughs> That's the one. This is, like, the one exception to that rule is if it's spoiled, it's going to completely ruin it. No, 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 uh, not really. No, no. It's not, No, it's still a very good movie. Okay. It's No, no, because the thing is, if that was the case, then I wouldn't watch it that many times. Mm. No. There are movies like that where the entire, like... Thing is hinges on the yeah. mystery. No. No. You can watch <laughs> this movie... <laughs> Fuck you, Just kidding. Um, no, like it'll. That movie is good regardless. But I'm saying like, this movie for me at least. This movie made, made me feel so much that like, I feel like I wouldn't reach that insane high if I didn't. If I knew the ending. Oh, uh, okay. You know, it's still very good. It's still so fucking good. It won editing. Did it? Right. It won seven things. It won a lot of things. I think it won it because the editing in the second half is incredible. But, I don't think it would be as good as it is if it wasn't so perfect. They, by edited. the way, they edited this fuck. They edited. Oh wait, no. Did they was shoot it, it? Like the, his first feature, this guy who edited everything everywhere was in his really. First oh my is, no, god! No, you told me that. God, did Either I? Either that or I'm wrong. Oh, it, maybe it was the second, but hold that's on. still incredible. By the way, of the Daniel Daniel's discography, their biggest thing before they did features was this movie called Interesting Ball. It's like a 15 minute short film. What about um, Swiss Army? Man. That's that's a feature. I'm, I'm saying before. Oh, okay. But the first thing that wasn't a feature was the interesting ball. And there's already motifs of this movie. Oh yeah, for sure. And then um and then they released Swiss Army Man. Very good. Pretty weird, but that's the Daniels. Right. And then this fucking comes out. Bro, your second feature is a banger. I love that. It's crazy. Oh my god. No, interesting ball, I feel like if you don't know if you haven't seen everything everywhere, you might be turned off by it at first. I feel like That the, is fair, actually. The the end but as interesting ball goes on, you start to understand it more but if your first exposure to the daniels is interesting ball you might just be like the sound no, are just weird no yeah <laughs> it's just too that weird. is honest yeah. that's fair i think that's very fair i mean i listen i'm so incredibly like i try to be like non-biased when i look at shit when i watch the interesting ball I'm like this is the best fucking thing on earth at first i was like <laughs> <laughs> no yeah at first i was like eh, i don't know but then i was like okay yeah they fucking i i get it okay i get it um Oh, fuck. Okay, Oscars, Oscars, Oscars. Um, come on, IMDb, you're falling off. <laughs> IMDb Ben fell off, boy. Shit. Letterboxd I didn't is where it's say at. it. I did not. Well, I guess say you can't it. really like find like information about the movie as much as you can on IMDb, but Letterbox is more fun. Okay, so they everything ever all at once. Swept most of the major categories. They won Best Picture, Best Director, Best Actress, Best Supporting Actor, uh, Best Supporting Actress, Best wow. Editing, and Best Original Screenplay. Best, Bro, the sweep! Best that uh, is Oscars crazy. dub in a while. Like, Dude. They, they usually don't take very many dubs, but yeah, that's how the dub. The Oscar fucking... You, okay, I, I, did, um, did, uh, what's the guy who played uh, Wayman? Yeah, he won. Okay, he won. That's so awesome. Dude. I love that. Okay, I only have one complaint, but I'm going to start with the positive stuff. Michelle Yeoh fucking won... 
Um, yes. Fucking uh, Kehu Kwan, dub. Uh, Jamie Lee Curtis, she was great. Um, uh, the Daniel, I think, how many fucking awards did the Daniels win? Um, let's see, let's see. Oops, sorry. Okay. The Daniels won, so, best picture, I guess. I'm gonna give that to the, the Daniels, fuck it. Best picture, uh, best director, both mm-hmm. directed, best, best, uh, original screenplay. They won three fucking Oscars. They did. Well, doesn't Best Picture go to the producer? I don't give a shit. <laughs> Damn, okay. <laughs> but no. I got like, it. Put it in my place. Um, one thing that's really sad. Listen, I think Jamie Lee Curtis is great. I think she's a great actress. She did great in the movie, obviously. Um, but the problem is best, a- best, supporting, best Supporting Actress, it was between two other films... I think, and then, bro, this movie's so good. Two everything ever all, all at once members were in for what? for for nominated for best actress, what, best supporting actress. It? Jamie Lee Curtis who won, and then Stephanie Shu, who's Joy. Oh, and okay. Look, come on, I get I mean... it. Listen, listen, I get it. Okay, Jamie Lee Curtis is like a legend in film, and she hasn't won anything. It's really sad, and she just she did great. Oh, bro, bro, Stephanie Shu, Stephanie Shu did so. Fucking good. Cool. She's basically a main character. Yeah, like she was really great. It, it's like when I saw really best fucking sold that. Oh my god, character so good. I, I'm saying such basic shit. It was <laughs> <laughs> because you can't say more. Because if you say more, I you know. just spoil everything. Yeah, like it. It sucks that I can't talk about how I feel about it because I really want you to see it blind. Like, yeah, I, no, I want to see. I mean, the way you've been hyping it up, like for the past. 40 years. <laughs> <laughs> Did you know that? I'm um, very hyped. I'm going to butcher his name. K. K. Hugh Kwan. K. Hugh Kwan. K. Hugh Kwan. Yeah. K. Hugh just... Kwan. K. Hugh Kwan. I literally say it and you fuck it up <laughs> immediately after that. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Um, but he was in the Goonies. He was one of the kids yes. in the Goonies. And he then he there. didn't work Bro. for like 30 years. He was in three films as a kid. Stopped doing films for 30 years. Came back. Hit, made this banger and refused to elaborate. Yeah. It's wild, dude. Yeah, it's um, wow. really inspiring. I'm not gonna lie; I don't even know if I can wait till my birthday. We kind of just gotta we gotta do it at some point. Oh, we're gonna, <laughs> yeah, we like, should probably do it. I'm, right I'm yeah. itching, dude. I want to watch this shit again. I'll, I've already seen it like three, four times, but I'll watch it again. I'm at five. I wa- let me let me think of the five I've done. I've done first time I watched it was at my friend's house. Um, so that's number one. Number two was with, I think it was, it was with Malarkey, and then it was with you guys Christmas. Oh wait, wait, fuck you in there. I wasn't there. Oops. <laughs> Uh, then it was home. Uh, with the lads on Christmas, and then four was with m- my friend Mira, and then five was with Jackie. Wow. That's a lot of times. <sighs> and I loved every single one. I cry at the same parts. I can't. I, okay, I, I would say I try so hard not to cry. I don't. I just let it happen. That, that movie, I let myself feel. You know, you know? there's certain... I, I try not to cry at every movie. There have been a few movies that have made me cry. The only movie where I was just like allowed myself to cry was uh, a ghost story. Yeah, I need to watch that. You haven't seen it? Oh my god! I showed my friend it like the a few months ago, and he he loved it. But not it's it's not for everybody. It's not for. Everybody. I'll give it a shot. It's, yeah, it's a. I I, I feel the same it's for gut wrenching. I feel the same for everything ever all. At once. Yeah, that's very true. I, I think everything ever all at once like the biggest turn off for people is like it is weird. The Daniels are fucking weird boys. They but, are very weird. And, and because of, like, how chaotic it is, sometimes, like, I can understand why people would be too overwhelmed to, like, understand the plot. Sure. And, and, and it's also, like, there is a few things you have to, like, pick up fast. Like, I picked up first jumping pretty fast. But, you know, if you don't get it, then you're not going to understand also why these the, things are happening. You know? the humor. I feel like the humor blends really well with uh, the messaging. But if you're just not a fan of that kind of humor, yeah. then you're... There's dick there's A big part of the movie is mm. just going to not there's be... There's dildos. There's yeah, a lot fun. of just, like, dick oh, jokes. Oh, yeah. 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 They're like, funny, but they're... Like, if you don't like dick jokes, you're just going to be like, well, that's dumb. Well, also, fuck you, mm. but, you know. Yeah, well, yeah. fuck you. If, uh, no, you no, no, like, no. I'm, saying, I'm saying fuck you if you don't like dick jokes. That's what I'm saying, too. Yeah. Oh, okay. I you, you looked at me like, like, <laughs> yeah. like you wanted me dead. No, it looked like you what? were flipping him off. Yeah, like, yeah, fuck you. Well, now I am, because you insulted me. Damn. Wow. All right, dude. Dude. Um, dude. But no, like I, I get why people don't like it. I don't get how people are like this movie is shit and overrated. I'm like, first off, kill yourself. Next. <laughs> okay. Whoa. One of my friends <laughs> actually to... thinks it's overrated. So cool it. Okay. Fuck you. Uh, have fuck a nice you. day though. Fuck you. Um, but have a great day. <laughs> why do I have a feeling like I know who you're talking about? <laughs> who oh no. It? You probably right, do. I'll, I'll censor it. 
Uh, is it, uh... No, it's actually... It really? I it's overrated. I don't like Oh, I was anymore. gonna say... That's yeah, can funny you guys stop naming actually. people now that you don't need to? Okay, yeah, I'm sorry. I'm like, making the editing room hell. Bro, the gonna be so <laughs> annoying. Wait, I... But I wanted to name, you know, everybody that I know so I could dox people. <laughs> hey, if you want to dox people... Yeah, welcome back to the Dobler, the, the yeah. doxing podcast. We'll find out. Then we'll show up to the house and be like, let's top this out. <laughs> <laughs> that, dude, that's how I'm going to be. If you, now that I know who fucking thinks it's overrated, I'm going to show up to the house and be like, Let, let's, let's talk. <laughs> let's chat. Dude, that would be hilarious. Dude, I better not. I better not. I okay. better not hate this movie. I better that, not. That's the one thing I'm worried about when I hype it up. Like, there's like insane expectations, and the thing is, for me at least, like it reached those. But you know, because like, I mean, the IMDb and the Rotten Tomatoes were insane. So I walked in. I didn't see a trailer before I saw it. It's one of the few movies me I've neither. seen in theaters I haven't me seen neither. with the trailer. Um, but I had high expectations just because the Rotten Tomatoes was like 99, and IMDb was like 8.9 or something when I saw it, mm -hmm. which was I think it's still pretty damn high. Yeah. No, I think the, the the hardest thing for me to, like, remember is that, like, the reason that it resonates so much with me is, like, my personal experience. Like, your, your number one can – doesn't have to – even, like, even if it's, like, objectively great, if they don't care about the message, it's, like – Right. You know? Yeah. Like, like there, there are a lot of sequences and undertones and fucking messages that the – that the movie like promotes that like I resonate with a lot and that's why I think it's so good. But like if you don't give a shit about it, then like it, right. it doesn't matter how much I say it's great. You know? Right. It, yeah, yeah, it is a very true. message based like if you resonate with it, then you're gonna love it movie. As opposed to like it just being like objectively great because of like fucking cinematography. I, I will say <laughs> I think regardless of what you believe or whatever, you're thinking it's, it's gonna be fun time. Baseline, yes. you're gonna have fun. You cannot just like dislike this movie. I I I, le I don't think you can be bored with this movie. I, at worst, if you really don't like dick jokes, you're gonna be annoyed sometimes, mm -hmm. right? But that's it. And you love dick, which is jokes. Um, <laughs> oh yeah, so, yeah. <laughs> Sam <laughs> dick joke with <laughs> Oh my god. Um, I'm not sorry. But but no. Uh, but no. Like if you like if you like the messages, which honestly I don't even want to say. Just not no, don't say it. No, if, if you, I, yeah, I want to go into this if, near blind. If you really do like the really messages, you're gonna fucking adore this movie. I it's cannot so imagine good. not loving this movie. No, you but you said multiverse shit, and I, I get just, no. I'm I understand. Like, oh that's, god, that sounds I it, so it bad. It puts a like, bad taste in your mouth. But I mean, there have been other multiverse movies that I've done it well, like Spider Verse. Yeah, that's um, true. No, yeah, that is it true. Is but then again, it's, than, like, it is it is more like Spider Verse and how they do the multiverse. The multiverse is such is non-essential part to why this movie is great yeah no yeah. it's i mean i guess it's a essential part in like the phys like the fights but like those are fun but like that's that's not why you watch it right you know? well also in characters uh, the in this the discovery of you know yeah of things of the themes i think it's important but it's not important in the sense that like dr strange uses it to just like have a cool set dressing for that's no reason. just yeah. multiverse like, for sake of multiverse yeah like. this multiverse like has a reason to exist in the story yes that isn't like pretty or you know like i, I can't explain it the, the when movie you, it, it couldn't it couldn't be it couldn't exist how it is without the multiverse yes you couldn't have the the themes be as potent as yeah. they are like in dr strange you could just have him like fly to another planet and it's the same thing like right would you or, arguably yeah, because it's just yeah. set dressing. No, uh, yeah, I agree. It's with just that. set dressing. And then, uh, okay, unless like, oh, unless you think about the fucking multiverse where he's paint. Okay, oh God, that makes I guess me, he like, can't do that. Doctor Strange, the second one, where he just like, uh, I watched he that. transports to like upside down New York or yeah, something. It's like, wow, wow, such a good movie. Yeah. Fuck you. It was it was a cool set, but the movie itself was not. Good. It was gorgeous. Marvel always makes fucking gorgeous yeah. movies. Yeah. That, but like, who cares? There's there's so much flash though, Listen, and not a lot of substance. At the end of the day, we still have Infinity War and Endgame. I'm happy. You know what? I'm. Kinda, I just consider it to end there. <laughs> I, I I am happy that like I didn't get super into Marvel because now I can watch Marvel movies and be like pretty colors and not be like they ruined the fucking plot. Because <laughs> like I'll watch like I watched Thor: Love and Thunder. Oh yeah. And as someone who does not give a sh two shits about the MCU or Thor or anything. I'm like, yeah, pretty movie. It was cool. And my, my, my friends left. Like, I want to fucking kill myself. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, like, I did not like that movie. Yeah, I, I walked out of theaters. I'm like, that's just weird. It, that, was, it was an interesting one because it was done by the same guy who did Ragnarok. But I found Ragnarok way better. Yeah, I agree. It, it felt way more fresh. And uh, Love and Thunder just felt like trying to recapture the magic of Ragnarok. It did, yeah. I've seen Ragnarok. It felt like a worse Ragnarok. It is. It's literally just a worse Ragnarok. 
Because Ragnarok is like an actually funny movie. It's, yeah, it's solid. It's it's rewatchable too. That one was just so weird. I real? really didn't I don't like remember it. a damn thing about. I Love didn't hate Love and Thunder. I, I, I actually went but... like when they showed his fucking his Thor's cock. Did that happen what? at some point? I thought the okay. They didn't actually what? show his cock, but when, when he was like naked, wasn't he naked at some point? Oh, in Thor. Love and Thunder. Yeah, he gets I think like Thor gets naked stands, in every movie. <laughs> he stands before Zeus, who like blows oh, his clothes. Oh off. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's like the only part I remember because okay. I'm straight. Yeah, what was that? <laughs> <laughs> Cause he like ins- he was like hiding from him or something. I I don't even remember. Zeus but they like blow this- the clothes off of him yeah. and then like I all think- the girls like they like all faint and shit like yeah. that. I was hoping Love and Thunder was gonna be more about um um well because like didn't the new Love world and Thunder wrote, have Lady or- Thor? Wasn't Natalie Portman? In yeah, Love and Thunder. Yeah, she was. She played Lady Thor, who yeah. had like cancer or yeah, something I like that. I don't remember. And it's an arc from the, the hammer. Mjolnir gave her like the powers, and she like. I don't, oh, yeah. She was fighting back I, the cancer. I care so little. Oh, sorry. The, not <laughs> no, no. no Dan, like, sorry. Sam, Sam, I care so little about what you're saying. <laughs> no, I don't think the movie... I'm not, like, personally offended. Like, the, the, the movie is not that good to me. The worrying thing is that my favorite part of the movie wasn't in the movie. I was watching. I was in theaters with friends, and someone said something, and then my friend next to me goes, like, r slash atheism. I was like, ah, ha, ha. <laughs> Funny joke. I think I... I didn't hate it just because the first time I saw it was in the drive-in with my friends, like a drive-in theater. That's cute. Um, with like the radio and shit, but the radio was ass, so we couldn't hear the movie. <laughs> so then when I actually watched it for the second time, I'm like, oh, that's what was happening. <laughs> 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 but I, I don't know. I care so little about this new Marvel phase or whatever. I liked. I think there are some good new Marvel movies that have come out since Endgame, like uh, No Way Home. That was that's fun. That was a good time in my life. Yeah, that was fun. Um. Oh, but I don't know, but Infinity War, like that era of Marvel when Infinity War was super popular and everyone was talking about it, unbeatable. That was so fun. Okay, I wish I was a Marvel fan for that context and then like not giving a shit right after Endgame. Yeah, yeah, I mean that's when the the decline started. Like right after Endgame, yeah, Endgame was great. I'm not gonna lie, I feel like the way I experienced it was probably the best because I because my family, my parents aren't like Marvel heads, but like. They they follow them so like they understand like plot and whatever, um, and I watched Infinity War with them and then I, I it was fun and then I'd be like what does that mean and they was like oh this is the context like, oh that's sick, and then same thing with Endgame, right? So like I I, I reaped the reward without having any investment, right? <laughs> so, right. That's true. You know right. it's kind of sick. Sense. Um, but I, yeah, I no. get why people don't want to watch like twenty movies. Just to get no, to not at this point. Game. It's just I too mean, much right now. It's too much. I don't know. I, I feel like up until phase, the, until this new phase, the the movies were generally like decent. Yeah, on, on I average, feel like back then, at least. I feel like back then when they released a new Marvel movie, there was like a lot of hype. But now when there's like a new one that's coming out, everyone's just like again. Well, we're doing I this have, rodeo, the same rodeo again. You had refreshers like Guardians of the Galaxy, like nobody had ever. Not that nobody had ever seen anything like it, but it was like it was such a refreshing yeah. uh, new thing. Ragnarok was like a refresher. Oh, I loved Guardians, um, all three of them. Yeah, oh, we good. watched them for the first time. We watched time them together over the summer, summer. Yeah, yeah, all three of them. Oh, I need, I, I want to watch three. I still fucking haven't because I because I meant to rewatch. Interesting. I meant to rewatch one good. and two, and I just didn't, so I can't watch three. Because oh, like, I think I've seen yeah. both, but I haven't. I think the highs of three are uh, the best of the franchise, but there's also some lows. That are the Three has some lows. Franchise. Yeah, but I really liked you know what they did with Rocket and everything yeah, like that. Course. Yeah, and obviously like they're great characters, they're great actors. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, they had the first ever Marvel f bomb in oh, that movie. Oh, I heard about this. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't even notice. So a lot of people Damn. were freaking out. A lot of people were saying that the movie bordered on R. My friend Riley was just was just like, like they're gonna he's gonna they're gonna reverse left ball. I'm like shut the fuck up. I didn't mean that. Sorry, Riley. <laughs> <laughs> when, it, when it happened, it, it was actually kind of natural. When I when I first happened, I was like I didn't even know. I was like a minute later, I was like oh they they, like fuck. they said fucking a Marvel movie. <gasps> yeah, um, Among Us. But it, it it was just natural. It was the car door, movie. right? It was the car door. When, I didn't even when know Nebula's I trying to open the car door, and then <laughs> he's like, the open car. the fucking door. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> Yeah, no, That's it was. Bananas. It didn't even feel out of place. No, but. it felt natural it, it, for his character too. Cause like, what other Marvel character, what other Marvel actor would say, "Open the fucking door," other than Star Lord? Right. True. Uh, Chris Pratt. That's really the only role that I think he really shines in. To be honest. Damn. Hot take. I'm kind of a hated the Mario movie. What is he? Like, what is he in? Mario. Jurassic. <laughs> well, okay. Jurassic <laughs> World. <laughs> 
Jurassic World. He was in Passengers. I never no, got I've into the it. Jurassic Park Me neither. movies. I just don't. I mean, big dinosaurs are cool, but like, I don't know. Mm. No, yeah. I mean, uh, the first one's good. The rest is like take it or leave it. I watched I found the one new Jurassic World so bad. Yeah, there was so one bad. that I watched recently. Not recently, a couple years ago, but it was one of the newer Jurassic World movies. And I was just like, this is okay. Like, mm. it's something crazy. I thought option, um, by the way. We're at like one thirty. What? Oh, really? Yeah. Well, we finish up. We'll wrap it up. No, what were you, what were you saying? We're at one thirty or something. Oh, okay. We'll wrap it up. Um, no, I mean Jurassic World. It's interesting because I watched Jurassic World before I watched Jurassic Park. Oh yeah. Yeah. So I kind of had an attachment to Jurassic World that I didn't for Jurassic Park. But that makes I recognize sense. it's like kind of a mid movie. Um, I just haven't really gotten around to like watching many of them. I feel like the second one had a decent setup. It set up like, well, I guess I won't, I won't spoil it. Yeah. But it set up like a really cool premise, and then the, th- um, the third one just kind of delayed that premise until later, and it was kind of just filler. The third one might have been the worst movie I've ever seen in theaters. It was oh, wow. Shit. The definition of a cash grab movie. Shit. It was terrible. Wow. It was terrible. Really plus, I, it was funny because I saw it on like a smaller screen because I was at the beach with my friend, and um, during some scenes it was IMAX, so like the dinosaurs' heads were chopped off at the top of the screen. <laughs> that is <laughs> funny. Because it was filmed at IMAX and like the screen was super small. Fuck man. So the dinosaurs just walking past me just saw like half the dinosaur. I'm sure that contributed to why. I hated it so much, but it, it was it was shit. Yeah, <laughs> it, like I consider that movie oh, man. worse than any Marvel movie that they've put out. Wow. Yeah. Damn. Damn. I was gonna say it. Hot, hot, low, low I was grace. gonna say it because I didn't have the opinion. Yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, there is one quick thing I want to bring up because okay. it's not gonna be relevant for too much longer. I, you know how hard it was to make the last episode's fucking thumbnail. I it, saw it. I actually really liked it. It wasn't. It was hard. a good thumbnail. It wasn't hard because, like, like editing it wise, but finding the photos sucked. And you want to know why? Why? I had to fucking Google the like, man tied up, <laughs> and half the results are fucking blurred. Oh! And I'm like, oh, come the fuck on, dude! And then, and then, all, and then all the ones that weren't not safe for work were like a fucking. Um, they, like, they were, like, only, like, the top half. So, like, it wasn't going to work for thumbnails. I'm like... You should have looked up, like, realistic Charlie problem depiction or something. Eh. But no, I, I, I was like, okay, fuck, I have to Google it. Uh, man tied up full body. That was way worse. Cause yeah, all the niche I would think stuff. so. You guys are freaks! I'm trying to edit <laughs> thumbnails here. What the fuck is wrong with you? Yeah, I fucking know. You finally told them. I was waiting for you to tell them. Yeah, the fucking time. They're looking yeah. at us really weird. Yeah, well, you think we're the Not freaks? Not you. I love you. You think we're the freaks? You're the <laughs> fucking freak. <laughs> Who were you talking to just then? Uh, uh, Vince. Vince. Ooh. Do I have to censor that too? No. Is that just a random name? Vince is watching. I know that. Vince. Oh, Vince. Fuck. Vince is kind of annoying. Hot take. Really? Yeah. I, I find the... Uh, Who's, who's Charlie? Who's okay, scammer? Charlie's annoying, but like, <laughs> Charlie's annoying, but we like, all we all think Charlie's annoying. That's true, but Vince is like my biggest supporter, so I can't. Re- if even if I thought he was annoying, I couldn't say it. What sure. the hell are you two talking about? You haven't picked up the bit. Oh fuck! No, I have not you. picked up the bit, so man. Squiggly diggly. My God, this it ain't funny. You're not funny. It ain't funny. You're not funny. Ugh. Is that how it ends? That's how it ends. I think that's really funny. <laughs> Are you serious? Thing. That's <laughs> really fucking. Nah, nah. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta. We can't end on that. That's, we can't that's, end on that's okay. I, I'm okay with ending on chaos, but ending it on a ah is a uh, <laughs> <laughs> yo. <laughs> end it there. <laughs> not only that, it was so abrupt. Like nobody, I bet nobody was expecting it to end. I on didn't that. either. Just like that could be funny, but probably not. Okay, wait. We need a cam- We need a name for this camera. So for wide. So we said we have Vince, we have a Charlie. Vince, Charlie. Demetrius. Wyatt. Demi- Demetrius. Demetrius. Demetrius Dingalus the second. Demetrius Dingalus Wyatt the second. <laughs> ASMR. Water bottle ASMR. This is gonna be so shit to have oh, to fucking man. go through the bit. I'm like, yo, what's up, Vince? Hey, what's up, Charlie? Yo, what's, what's up? up? Demetrius, Demetrius Dingle Demetrius. Wyatt the second. Demetrius <laughs> Wyatt Dangalish. No, Demetrius. We don't even remember Demetrius the name. Demetrius Dingle Wyatt the second. Demetrius Dingle Wyatt the second is the, oh, the main character. Demetrius. Dingle, Wyatt, 
Z second. Or just D D W. I wonder what would happen if I threw a water bottle. W D forty. That's a W D forty. We need that for our fucking door, dude. Oh yeah, our our squeaky squeaky ass door is still squeaky. So our our dorm room door. One day, like September, we yeah. were just we were walking out and it wouldn't close. Like it was just stuck open, and we we had to like pull it with the weight of the fucking weight we were doing today in the gym Whoa. to get it closed, which is a lot of weight. Shit. Yeah. <laughs> um, because we're big, we're big and strong. Yeah. Um, Audio listeners have never seen our face. Like, dude, I'm ripped. I fucking thirteen packs. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> thirteen packs. And people that are watching on YouTube, I'm actually um editing myself down. In real life, oh, I'm, yeah. I'm Jack. But yeah. we put in like a work order, and some guy came and fixed our door. And now our door closes so fast. It, and when it when it slams, like the whole fucking hall, it's like a echo through the whole hall. It is <laughs> so loud. It's like the door's asserting its dominance over all the other doors. Shit. It's like, it is so, it's so loud. So loud. Speaking and squeaking. Yeah. Shit. All right. That's it. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Dude, we literally said, yeah, thanks for watching. By the way. By uh, the way. <laughs> uh, all right. Bye. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah, what go, are you still doing go, here? You Please freaks? go and do something with your life. Bro, go do your homework or go to your do, do your job. Talk to your kids. For real, the whole, the <laughs> talk to your kids. <laughs> Please talk to your kids. <laughs> like I'm looking at you, Demetrius Stingle Wyatt, the second. <laughs> <laughs> Yo! I will never be able to do that. All right. All right. Goodbye. Bye. Thank you for watching. Bye. 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 Mwah.